Here we go, here we go, here we go. Uh, who is it? Oh, gosh, it's Isabel the doll. Uh, we're not home. We're not home. So, never guess who I saw at the romance festival yeah. yesterday. Uh, who's that? Oh, uh, it was your wife? <laughs> she was alone, you know? She was alone at the romance festival? Yeah, oh, yeah. She was hooking up with all kinds of people over there. Oh, my God. What the heck? Yep, here's a fart for ya. Let's go. Woo! Oh my gosh, look how cool this is. Oh. <laughs> Got a geode. Got a geode. Hey everybody, welcome to the stream. I'm Dr. Glow on. Oh my gosh, this works. I will have broken the game. Oh my gosh, this is. Oh no. Oh no, Bob. Um, bo uh, Bob. Oh no, oh no, oh no. What's that? Ah! You gotta get out of here, dude. Keep walking. Walk faster. <laughs> Whoa! Yeah, there you go. Cars and Sims 4. What? This is the new Rat Hole song I decided. Let's go, Rat Holes. You put them in the build and the people go nuts because Sims don't seem to care about the spiders on the wall. But when a rat comes out, they stop what they're doing and check it out. This is the Rat Hole song. Wearing my diapers. Who's gonna wipe me? I'm a baby now. What? I eat applesauce. I don't like any other food. Give me those chicken nuggets. Cheese. I love it. But it makes me constipated. What? You... The dog is, uh, is sleeping now. Why you always say when the dog's sleeping? Yeah. It's always dead. <laughs> no, it's not dead. It's sleeping. Start cheating. To the game. People tell me I'm cheating at the game. But I ask you, why would they put this in the game if it was a cheat? I can build as many as I want And I feel it really helps the people out So I'm never gonna stop Placing all the cabinets It's gonna be a great time in my house Cabinets I'm building cabinets I may have no money left, but it's so worth it. I'm building cabinets. Welcome to the Hanukluzium. We've got dinosaurs that blabbers have never seen before. Our bug life area is so alive. And we've got the rare whiskey bass. The rarest sea bass around. Only at the glue 
Zium, only have the clue. Zium, don't bother going to that blabber's new museum. Come instead to the clue. Zium, it's the best place around. And it's free. Hey guys, make sure you hit that follow button. And if you're feeling real generous, hit that subscribe button. Every subscriber helps out the glue and out. And you get a bunch of sweet emotes in the process. Well, that's it for me. Bye-bye. You're in my world now, Nancy. You're in my world now. Hey, welcome back to another stream. How's everyone doing today? Good to see you. Happy weekend. Well, we're going to be continuing our building of the uh, Hundred Baby Challenge House. Hopefully, we finish today. I don't know. But we do, and we can keep on rolling along with the Hundred Baby Challenge. You know? Uh, but it's good to see you, all of you. A, B, C, D, E. <laughs> yeah! It was a good one. I, I, I fell asleep. Um, but I, I saw the beginning of it, so... <laughs> Hey, Madly Mud, how you doing today? You did a thing. I did 50 uh, fares for Uber this week to get my maximum weekly bonus. First time back to work after three years. I discovered um, not uh, working was a big factor in my decision. Well, that's awesome. That's awesome, Madly Mud. That's so cool. That's so cool. Uh, I really need this. I have been uh, having a rough time. Oh, I'm so sorry about that, James. Yeah, we'll be hanging out. And, and later on today, we're going to get a gist of a new game. So, to Sims, we check out a new game. It's going to be a great night. Great night. And then tomorrow, we're going to be streaming uh, during the afternoon. Uh, playing some uh, Disney. Do my belly. Yeah. Filmmaker freak gifted a fez to manly Filmmaker freak gifted a tier one sub to Thank manly you so much, much for that. Uh, 1101 gift subs in the channel. Hey, appreciate that. Thank you, film. Delu, thank you so much for that as well. Um, um yes. Um, Hi. Hello. Uh, so I'm gonna get a um a booster on Monday. So uh, I don't know how that's gonna make me feel. You know. Uh. Uh, Monday or well, Tuesday, so I'm taking Monday off. I don't know about Tuesday, but I'll be but I'll be here on uh, Sunday. Okay, that's the plan. Uh, what is this game? Is it free? It's, uh, it's not out yet, but uh, you'll see. You'll see. It seems cool. It seems like a Minecraft style game. So uh, I may have missed uh, this, but uh, this house is gonna be based on 2000s. Yeah, it shows of the 2000s exactly. We've already started it a little bit. We started on Monday, um, and uh, we got some stuff done. So we have to uh, waste like three months after getting a. Uh, it's like a week. It's like a week film. That's what they told me. What is that? That, that's a tier three. That's a tier three. Capaldi, hmm? the golden fez is yours. If you believe we've got a picture perfect plan, then we've got you fooled because we only do the best we can. Mm. And sometimes we make it and yeah. sometimes we fake it. Yeah. But we get one step closer each and every day. We'll figure it out on the way. Sure. Yay! Um, is that from Lion King or? Um Yay! In Polo 893. That's what they told me, Phil. I don't know. We were down. like so I'm not used how, to like, just starting a week, on time. Glue pog glue pog I swear positivity must be your middle name, cause whatever that positivity was, it was brilliant. Oh. You made me smile and I may have laughed a little yesterday. Oh glue yay! Glue lil be glue lil be glue yay. So lanky too. Oh, uh, okay. It's from Lizzie McGuire. Is it true? Is that true? We have a boost train happening right now. If we get to level five and, and beat it, we'll do an auto tag. Oh, so good luck with that. You think I'm gonna get? If I think I'm gonna be turning into a mutant, bring me all the strains. No, I kind of want to. You know, I wanted this because of the um the uh, Twitch comp. You know, I want to be like 
help me. Um, so. Nurse underscore Sky gifted five fezzes. Boosting. Boost trade. That's right. Nurse Sky, thank you so much for the five gifted. Appreciate that. Uh, hopefully you get... Uh, yeah, Wolverine claws will be sweet. Um, I kind of want to be like... Um, force field powers, though. You know? I feel like force field powers is like the... Um, the... Uh, anti-social superpower, you know? It's like, alright, I'm gonna go in there and save the day, but I really don't want to touch anybody. Uh, I'm just gonna walk in, you know? I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna walk in, my full feel will do the rest of it, you know? It's like, hands off. Literally. Invisibility is also very uh, anti-social, but there's not much you can do to save the day so happy to be if you're here today. invisible. I am so Thank you. To be a part of such an amazing community. Glue hug. Thank you so much for that. Appreciate that. Jude, thank you again for the five gifted. Like, you know, if you're invisible, it's like, okay, you can kind of sneak behind people, maybe punch them in the back, but like, you, you still want to be kind of strong though, right? You know, you could like, you know, if you punch someone in the back and they're like really strong, it might be in invisible. You're still going to be like doing nothing to them, you know? If you got Wolverine claws, then you'll have to get surgery to make the, the bones Metallic. Oh, is that whole thing? Is that just her? Is that her? Yeah. Resting full spilled face. Yes. Karen, Hi, thank Doc. you so much. Um, hey, Saffron. Can Brian Here's say alarm. shenanigans? Glue cool. You know what? Brian can say shenanigans, surprisingly. He loves he can't say, but shenanigans he can't say. Um, what place did uh, uh, Zeus get? What is uh what uh the what uh, place did they get? Uh, I just I will say this. You look very dapper. Carl, how are you doing today? Good to see you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh thank you so much for that gift as well. Appreciate that. Um uh, sounds like he uh, can. Yes, he can. Uh fourteenth place. How the team do though? Like how the team do overall. Uh, Meg, thank you so much for that. Uh, instead of superpowers, I just want, uh, an Iron Man suit. You know they're making an Iron Man game? That's gonna be sweet. Uh, they're also making, um, this EA's making that, and also EA is making a, um, a, uh, Black Panther and Captain America game set during World War II. So that's gonna be awesome. I can't wait for that one. Um, does the boost train, uh, f flicker crazy for anyone? Uh, it's not. Maybe refresh. Yeah. I hope they don't mess With it up. Well, under the fence for 11 know. months. Hey, Doc, Thank you so much. I'm happy to catch the stream tonight. Glue hunk. What game are we getting the gist of tonight? Oh, it's a surprise. But it's kind of like a, it looks like a Minecrafty thing. You'll see. You'll see. Surprise. Um,. Uh, Rick, thank you so much for that. Uh, uh, use those resubs, people. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're so close. We're so close. Also, we're getting to the end of the um, the September. So, if you have a Prime sub and you would like to switch over to a Tier One, uh, now's the time because you'll save money by doing that. Also, if you already subbed and you want to extend and get like a few months, I think you can do that. Think you can. Alex C. Strong. Don't say right now. The for 23 months. Thank you, Alex. Appreciate that. Uh, speaking of Black Panther, uh, uh, who saw the picture of? Oh, I haven't yet. Um, speaking of gist, did you see my? De I did. Sorry, film. I did. I was pretty tired today. I, I worked on a um. I worked on a uh, a TikTok video. <laughs> Last night, they, and I and I posted it this morning. Uh, witchy woman, forty-five months. Thank you Little so much. Uh, the fest for forty-five months. That, um, Happy forty-five months, stock. The slime video was actually hilarious. Thank you. Yeah, I think what we're gonna do, we're gonna do like the gist of it, and then we do like little mini gists, where basically it's like I give you a gist in the the. In the amount of time Gabrielle Lee 93 you know, is now under the, the video. Hey, you are a 
First time subscriber! Thank you so much for that, Anna. We got fifth place. Oh, nice. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for that, Anna. Um, it probably would have been, uh, been second place. Uh, it probably would have been second place and dodgeball, yeah. I'm, I know, I know, uh, Zeus has been, like, practicing so hard for that, so. You're so magical. Ah, Thank you. Hey! Send to me, let's have a look. Thank you so much for the five gifted. Let's have a look. Um, let's uh, do this. Here. I have a theory about the Disney Dreamlights. Uh, maybe if they add Yay! Timon Ashley and Pumbaa under the also in the sort of collection months. or something like that. Something like Animal Crossing. Mm. Insect collection. That would be cool. Getting a, a bug net. That would be sweet. I love that theory. I hope that's true. I like that theory. Let's go over here. Uh, extended for six months. Thank you so much for that. Ashley, thank you so much for that. Uh, um, thanks for the stream. Always uh, cheers me up. Oh, good to have you here, Jen. We have a... Uh, we're in level four of the hype train right now. If we get to level five and beat it, we will do some art before we get into The Sims. I'm going to check out this thing Capaldi sent me. Isn't that a nice transition? It's real nice. Okay, let's have a look. Let's have a look. Holy moly. I also accept for six months. Jude! Thank you so much. Love, appreciate that. Thank you for the five gifted. I don't know if it actually tells me when you're extended, so I apologize that I'm not like calling those out. Alyssa's passion gifted uh, but I mean, thank underscore you so much for that. Sing. Um, Alyssa's passion gifted a tier one oh, sub to Jen underscore cool. Sing. They have given 18 gift subs in the channel. Yay! This is for the new movie. Violet Poodle cheered Dex 200. Hang on, what, uh, that's what, uh, Capaldi sent me. <laughs> Definitely bad who made that transition. Yes, we should. <laughs> We should, um... Boostin! Level 5 so of the hype train happening! Boostin makes me feel good. You know my uh, daughter watched her day? She watched, um... The cartoon Ghostbusters. Yay! Do you don't know that one? Gabrielli the real Ghostbusters? Glue fez, I love the fez. Ah, Gabrielle, thank you so much for that. Appreciate that. She got. She's only into Ghostbusters right now because there's a song in Just Dance. The Ghostbusters song is in Just Dance. Silly redhead girl. Under the hey, for thank months. you for the eleven months. Um, there's a song from uh, Just Dance, which is the Ghostbusters song, and so she's like, "I want to watch Ghostbusters," and we're like, "Yeah, you're not because you know the Ghostbusters movie is, you know, it's got some scary parts in it." For a six-year-old, we're like, no, I don't think you should watch that. She's like, no, I want to watch it. I want to watch it. I want to watch it. I'm like, no, you, we're gonna give you nightmares. So we're like, well, what about the cartoon version? Really look good under the fest for 14 months. Love being in the Glooby Fam Glue Hut. Ah, oh, thank you so much. Uh, it's on um, it's on uh, Amazon. So <laughs> the original Ghostbusters movie, you know, the beginning. With the um, librarian? Lazloxo, That's scary. That's scary. Lazo, thank you so much for the four months. Uh, should have like nightmares. Had all the toys with the real Ghostbusters, yeah. Tokens. We skipped that part for a while. Which yeah. Prime yeah. Just got home from helping my brother move. I'm so tired. Glad I can finally setting in and watch your stream to relax after a oh, long nice. day. Oh, nice. You and your community rock doc. Well, Glue I'm hug. glad you're part of it. Uh, thank you so much. I uh, hope you had a good, uh, a good move. Dex 200. This art addict needs art. Well, Glue we're 36%. We're so close. We're so close. It can be scary, especially for little ones. Yeah, definitely. They're, 
I mean, Ghostbusters is not like a scary movie, but there are scary parts about it. And we're like, yeah, maybe, maybe watch the cartoon version. The very 80s cartoon. Is that come the 80s? It's 80s, right? 80s or early 90s. It's uh, very aged. <laughs> All right, let's launch The Sims here. Um, do this as well. I had a nightmare once because of... Uh, oh, the Vigo painting. Yeah, that is very scary. Yeah, yeah, that's what Ghostbusters 2, though. But yeah, that is super scary. My guy Max loves the tales of the crypt. The cartoon's not the old creepy one. Oh, they made cartoons of Tales of the Crypt? Really? Uh, thank you, Gabriel. Appreciate that. Uh, yeah, the Vigo painting. <laughs> I am Vigo! You will see the new movie? The new, new Ghostbusters? Jezzle in 30, under the fest for two months. Thank you so Mars much, uh, Cheer Mars. Two hundred. All right, Doc. I know yeah, this is good. going to be a controversial topic and question. Oh boy. It's torn the world in two, and people have strong opinions about it. Oh boy. But I have to ask you, oh no. since you're from the UK, uh -huh. how do you feel about the Great British Bake Off? <laughs> oh, you thought I was going to ask about something else, <laughs> didn't you? LOL. I hope you and yours have been feeling better. <laughs> glue hunt, glue hunt. <laughs> I don't know about the baby. I uh, I haven't. I like that show. I've not seen it in a while. Uh, where's why is the Sims or black screen on here? Um, <laughs> it's good. I liked it. I enjoyed it. I had not seen a new episode for a while. Um, but yeah, is there is there is there Great British Bake Off controversy? I don't know what's going on. Just I'll just show my screen. <laughs> For some reason, the video captures not working. I don't know. Why does he have a Canadian accent? Oh, uh, I lived in Canada for like a year and a half. So, that's gotta be it. That's gotta be it. It's because I lived in Canada for two years. Or a year and a half, really. The least controversial topic. I tell you what, there's been a lot of like drama this week. So, less controversy is good. Boosting. You saw clinical the grocery store today. Did, did you did you get some? Uh, I suggest wild cherry or the blackberry one. It's good. Uh, let's do this. We'll do this instead of what the music we're playing. Um, I'm updating my system. We're gonna we're getting a whole new thing. We're getting a whole thing, and it's gonna be good. Hopefully. Um, and hopefully that means my computer won't be so laggy, um, or maybe more laggy. Who knows? Who knows? Uh, either way, it'll be different. <laughs> Rick, the laggy or less laggy. There is no such thing as too much rat hold. Thank you for the community and the gameplay. Best show ever. Thank you so much, Rick. Uh, More kitchen, please. Let's load this up here. I got a fan film. I got a fan. I got a fan. It's gonna be sweet. It's quiet too. It's gonna be fine. Don't worry about it. It's gonna be fine. Um, out of context, rat hole does not sound good. We are your fans. I need you to, I need you to, I need you to come over. Um, put, I'll put my computer on top of you. Uh, all right, let me show you what we got here. Uh, let's go here. Do, 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 do. I show what I got so far, and you let me know what you think. You let me know what you think. <laughs> My 
my my laptop stopped playing audio to my TV, so I switched to my other laptop, uh, and now that's not working either. I got no dock sound at all. Dang, you know I've had a lot of technical issues today too. It was just one of those days. Is there a solar flare going on? Seriously, I've had all kinds of issues. All right, this is what we got so far. Um. um This is what we got so far. This kitchen is the best, I think. It's like a TV show kitchen, right? It needs some like decorations, but like you know. And then the uh, the living room there. What do you think? What do you think? I think I I think I turned off tour mod, so we we had to restart the game because uh, I got into the game too early. But it's your birthday. Happy birthday to you. Did you put in the, uh... No! I didn't! Okay, well, I gotta restart the game then. We definitely gotta restart the game for that. Did you send me that? Uh, I still gotta do the upstairs. Nothing's done up here yet. So we gotta gut all this and do that. Uh, and then the house is done. And obviously clutter. What do you think of the kitchen? Let me get your opinion. Because there was... So, uh, when, I, when, I, when I mentioned the idea... See, my chat was super excited. And then I did it, and then the chat was like, no. So I don't know. In the basement? Yeah, basement kind of says the same. So basically, the idea is like, a, it's like a Rachel Ray show. It's like a Rachel Ray set. Is what the idea here. But it's a kitchen. <laughs> um, it's Y2K. Shoot the Y2K thing. I would rather see an actual 2000 kitchen rather than a retro 80s one. Mmm. It's adequate. Oh. It's fun. It's, uh, you like it. You agree. I feel like that'd be boring, though. Can I, can I keep the same, can I keep the same, like, setup, but update it some? So we still have this fun idea. I like the idea. You love the cooking theme, though. You love the cooking show theme, though. Okay, okay. So maybe we can just change up maybe the uh, the colors a bit. Um, the layout looks good. We just change. We just change some. Yeah, but those kitchens look boring, though, Lily. I'm gonna be honest with you, straight up. There's a reason why they only lasted one. Decade, you know what I mean? <laughs> um, I'm wrong. Well, send me, send me some pictures. Change my mind. Send me some pictures. Kitchen burn. <laughs> send me some pictures. Change my mind. Maybe I'll. Uh, I'll change my, send me some pictures on Discord. <laughs> Like this one. That looks like something out of Home Alone. Oh, it is on Discord. That's 2000s? That's Rebber? See, I've never heard of that term before. I've never heard of that. I've never. Uh, I've never ever watched that uh, show. She's a person. Pronounce what? Who? Wait, what? Oh, this is a show. Oh, Reba. Oh, I don't see that show. Sorry, I thought that was a style. <laughs> I thought it was like an architectural style. I was like, I never seen that. I never heard of that style before. <laughs> the singer. Okay, and they had a show. See. I would say this last time how like I feel like I never I didn't watch a lot of shows during the um during the two thousands. Alright, well if this is the style, then who am I to argue? I will uh recreate some of this in here, okay? Uh, but first I gotta restart the game, because I forgot to put my mods on. We're having issues with a mod yesterday, I had to like switch out a bunch. Right, did you send me a new mod folder?
Um, one second. One second. This is the... This is obvious capturing the game right here. I don't know why it's like this. <laughs> yeah, sure, sure. <laughs> Um, I'm 26 film. I wasn't even born then. But what is the, uh, what is the math on that one, Oglaria? When would I, when would I have been born? Can I request a song for my birthday? We'll see. Always been that. I would, I would, I would have been born in 98. Yeah, so I was like a kid then. Clearly, I don't remember that. I wouldn't remember. I was like a kid. 1996? Yeah, I mean, I would have been like, what, a toddler? Yeah, yeah, so that, that map does kind of check out. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <coughs> I grew up with a set of Rachel Ray, so of course my experience growing up was like what Rachel Ray's kitchen looked like. Okay. Um, okay, so don't panic. I don't have any, I don't have any mods on. In my mad dash to fix whatever's going on last night, I deleted all my mods and I have I don't know how to get them back. But no one panic, because I'm gonna fix this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I did. Canada doesn't have TV shows. <laughs> no one panic. Everyone panic. Um don't worry about it. I shall just download the mods again. Yay! I don't know what bad sent me the last this one, but I will use this one. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Do you ever watch uh, Cat Dog? Oh, yeah! With the cat and the dog were like connected. That was cool. That was a cool show. Okay, put this in here. Hopefully, these are not like super old versions of the mod, because I don't know. Um, should be fine. And Lily, you sent me your mod, right? Looks like it. Okay. Let's see how it works this time. What's going on here? Why? Why? Why would OBS do this? Hello? Why would it no longer show the game anymore? Um, hello? Hey, boy. Alright, whatever. Just just capture the window. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> um, maybe. All right, let's go. It's gonna take some time setting up, though. Obviously, always does. It's like never done that for me. It's never done that for me. La 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 What song would you want if you did want a song? If you wanted a song, like which one would you want? Uh is the capture soul set up rights? In what sense, Brad? I don't know. Would it if uns I mean it's always been the same setting. Fought like a trampet. I can do cabinets. Whose birthday was it today? Whose birthday was it today? It was Joel's birthday. Joel! Theoretically, if I was going to sing, what song would you want me to sing? Oh, man. Okay. Oh, boy. One second. Hmm. Mods! Why would they not come pre on? 
They said men, 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 men. Okay, well, since I'm, we saw the game like a bunch of times, I can do that. I can do that. I didn't do it. No, it wasn't you. It wasn't you. Was it Lily? Was it your mod? Okay, here we go. Here we go. Uh, one second. We find it. The men, 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 men song, right? Okay. Here we go now. Men, 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 men. Oh. I'm in the void. Men, 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 men. Oh, lovely men. Men, 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 oh lovely men. Men, 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 all the men. Men, 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 men. Men, 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 also women. Men, 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 all the men. Men, 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 oh lovely men, also women, and everyone. Men, 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 men. I feel like I'm conducting a really like. Intense interview right now. And where were you? And where were you during that time? Because we have evidence that you were not there. You were somewhere else. Um, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. I'll get there. There we go. like holding up a bunch of cards it's like holding up a bunch of like uh, a whole house built of cards and it's like crumbling and I'm just trying to keep it all together you know, they, listen when I have the sims going it d d doesn't like anything else but I don't know why I don't know why but when the sims is on it like you can't do anything on the computer Everything is just like struggle. It's like struggle. Oh, my Sims is running. So the alerts, the uh, transitions, me opening up even like Discord. It's struggle. So anyway, the corruption is spreading, but we're back in now, so we're good, and everything's good to go. So, let's check out this uh, thing that Lily made for us. Uh, Sims works fine, though. And Sims is, works fine. It's just... I don't know if the computer just, like, decides that the, the Sims needs all the, um, the... What do they call it? The uh, processing. There's nothing left, Okay, let's see here. Where should this go? Hey, 
Hey, Firefly, how you doing today? It comes in white as well. Okay, I kind of like it there. What do you think? You gotta scale it up. It's gonna be too big then. Alright. Alright, let's see what we can do here. You like that bookshelf? I think the living room is kind of done, except for some more clutter here and there. Um, this is supposed to be like a, a house based in the 2000s, yes. And the kitchen is kind of supposed to be like um, uh, like a TV show, a TV cooking show. Um, how about that? Looking at this picture here. Hello? Looking... Ooh, see that? Look at this picture here. Um, what we got here? What we got here? The, to the top is in right. Bless this mess too. Um, I know I, I know you have more in there, but I have this picture here, so I feel like. Do I, do I need other pictures? This might be good. I think this is what we want, right? Yes, this is what we want right here. It can't hurt to have other references. Okay, hang on. Oops. Don't worry about that. Um, why is my sims not working? Oh, you know what happened? There was an update to Windows, so that's cool. So... One second. It's wine o'clock. Just have something that says, like, family. In the blocks, though. Windows! <laughs> Every time I update my windows, there's a part of me that goes like, maybe it'd be better now. Maybe this is the update where they figured it out. You know? They, uh... They figured it out. Somehow my computer works like a million times better now. You know? Your dad whinged about the uh, Windows update last night. Yeah. It told me there was an update. I was supposed to not update it. It could be important. If Windows is saying you gotta update, you gotta update. What can you do? What can you do? That's a show. That's a cooking show. That's a cooking show. Carly! Carly Jean, under the fest for 24 months. Um, Two years wild. That's good eats. So happy to be here. Thank you so much for that. Uh, a lot of streams are having issues with OBS and Windows updates. I know, it's so annoying. Daniel Sodalize cheered X1000. Lots of streamers have been having issues with OBS and Windows updates and games crashing this week. Glue shrug. I don't know what those are though, Capaldi. <laughs> I don't know what that means. Is that it? Is that... Uh, every time you update Windows, this is true. Every time you update Windows, it like literally like messes up the sound. Every time. It's the style. I know that, but like, what? That one? That's too fancy. This is a. This is like a mansion. I'm not making this kitchen. Look at this, like the marble. This is a mansion. This is a mansion. Uh, I'm doing good. How you doing? Is a place in Italy. Yeah. No, I know. I know it's a place, but I don't know like what the star meant. There's another one. I think we got the gist of it with this one, though. Yeah, I mean, wood. Wood, right? Wood counters. And tile. So, like that one. And that. You know, the Good Eats kitchen. Terracotta colors. The orange word. 
That's a good counter. Okay. La 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 This isn't gonna be as nice, but it'll be fine. The transition, I mean, it won't be as clean. Oh, that's the right color. Oops. Do 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 do. Oh, what is it? What is it? That one? Wait, do these not match? Is that the color? But they don't match, though, game. But they don't match, game. 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 Oh, is it that one? No, no. It's definitely supposed to be that one. But that doesn't match, though. Oh, that's okay. Thank you, darling. Put it right there. Oh, thank you. Hi. Say hi. I love you, darling. Bye-bye. child. It's the lighting? Is it? Bye-bye, Dad. Bye-bye. Love you. Love you, darling. Um... Anyways, my mom said Thank you, um... I don't think it's the lighting. Is it? Why? Why can't I fix this match? No, it is, it is like noticeably lighter. Well, we can't have a ball then. Uh, you should do streams, uh, play games with kids. Yeah, maybe in the future. <laughs> Why Sims? Oh, is this like a base game one too? It's like a base game one. Um, I'm pretty sure, I mean. Okay, that, okay, hang on. Oh wait, are these are these different? Cause this has more swatches. One, two, three, four, five, ten. Oh no, it has ten. It's just <laughs> They're different swatches, why? Why? The swatches are out of order. But that is a swatch though. Oops. I mean. Oh wait. Well. Oh, 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 it's this one. Wait, but that's even That's even brown, that's gray! Okay, it's that one. What? What? Crown Laurel what? under the fest for 16 months. Yeah. Look at that. Look at that swatch there. Look at that swatch. Brown and the gray. This one is gray and light gray. What? Okay, well, we found it at least. Thank you so much, Crown Laurel. Appreciate that. Um... Oh boy. You like that too? It's there, just not labeled correctly, so I didn't see him. Okay, well, we're good at least. At least we have him. Uh, I don't know, actually, let me actually try. Because it's kind of weird, doesn't it? I don't know if this looks weirder. Uh, oh, wait, does it have a. If it's got a little curvy bed? Hmm. Would that look, would that look cool if it was like that? Does that look cool? Or does that look weird? With the counter then curves. But obviously like juts out there. This has to be regular counter because this is like the kitchen counter, you know? 
Laurelie Heim used their Twitch Prime. Let them. Oh wow. 27 months. Brian still can't say my name right, Gluhan. <laughs> One of these days. Thank you so much for 27 months. Appreciate that. Yeah, it looks a lot better than it did before. So that's good. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I'm kind of. I'm going to like heavily uh, use this as inspiration. Um, because it kind of feels like a kitchen that would be in this kitchen. You know? Like some of these were, some of these look a little bit more luxurious. I mean, I guess that's a bit more down to earth. But, um. This has all the clutter on it, so. Hanging pots and stuff. Yeah, 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 yeah. A ki it, would be, it looks like a kitchen that would be in this kitchen. Sometimes I say stuff hoping that you don't hear what I'm saying. What is a Tustin kitchen? You know what? I have no idea. I mean, Amy, I don't know. We're learning together. We're learning together. Change the tire on the fl on the wall. Yes, yes, hundred percent. Yes. That will all change. Okay. Um, should we just continue with this tile here? And obviously this is all gonna go. It's all gonna go. You never like that, uh, you never like that green tile. I love that green tile. You like the yellow? I think pretty much the same setup, just uh, just in this new style here. Is there a, a cabinet version of this one? Is it this one? Is that it, or is it this one? It's this one. <laughs> no, no. I spent so long find that tile. Lily, you want me to keep the green? I feel like people who don't like the green. That's what started this whole problem. <laughs> I appreciate you finding that green though. You did a good job. I like it. I mean, like I said, I'm gonna go back and say I like the way it looked, but I understand. You, you all said you didn't, so we're changing it. <laughs> Um, it needs shelves and stuff. Well, it's the same setup. I like. I. I, I still like the setup. I still like the. Um, uh, it's. It is a TV show. I think that's a fun conversation piece. When someone comes into the stream, you know, they're like, "What's going on here?" And it's like, "This is like a TV show." You know, it's a fun conversation piece to have with new viewers. Um, I'll do that floor too, yeah. It's a t yeah, well, the whole thing is a TV show. So when they're in the kitchen, they're filming a cooking show. Cause, uh, here's a thing, chat. The rise of the cooking show was in the 2000s. Is what one person said one time, and so I believe them. You know? It's true. It was. The ugly stale tile has got to go somewhere. Food Network.
Not in the UK. UK was doing their own cooking shows. Thank you, Danny. Julia Child would argue that Doc Rise of Cooking in 2000's Glue Done. I don't know who that is. You um, you know you could do this kitchen as a save as, and I, um, and have chat vote on which kitchen they like more. No, that's too complicated, Lily. I think chat's loving this one. I think chat is loving it. Am I wrong? Am I wrong? Are y'all not loving this? Cause I'm loving it. We love whatever Doc loves. <laughs> oh boy. Hang on, what if I do this? Hear me out. Hear me out, hear me out, hear me out, hear me out. Hear me out. Okay. Uh huh. Someone in chat right now is like, "Yeah, this is so much better." Finally. Wait, wait. La la la. La 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 Sign up for HBO Max now um, and help Tazak Glow out. Thank you, Lena. Appreciate that. Uh, doc, long decade. This is breaking bad home. Trust me. Trust me. Trust me. Trust me. Trust me. I think this could be a failure. I don't know. I'm thinking here. I'm thinking. Thinking. Can I get a door that's good enough? Can I just get a door? The door that I want. All these doors too big. Oh, this is a good door. There we go. Yeah. Yeah, but I can't get the same color though. I've added like a little thing along here. Nah, I'd be totally usable. Does that look stupid? Is that? Does it? Does it look stupid? Does it look stupid? You can say yes. I am confused. <laughs> um, it's stupid. I just kind of want to have like this wall go like this, you know, along the top there. It's stupid. Oh. Okay. Um, I, I can. I mean, I can try these ones. Um. Guess. <laughs> uh, I'm fine. Sometimes we try things and then they're stupid, and then we give up. All right, uh, that didn't work. I wanted to see if it would work. Uh, uh and you're not very good. Hey, be on Max. Here we go. Uh. I'll show, I'll show you the inspiration the picture. This one right here. You see how I got this wall along here? See that? That's my inspiration. 
See, it's all in a cubby. It's all in a cubby. That was my inspiration. Um, Lauren, thank you so much for that. Uh, you see? See? Oh, no, it makes sense. Try it again. Uh, we were like, what? I don't get that. I didn't, I didn't, you didn't get what I was. You didn't get what I was doing. Are they are they yellow cabinets? <laughs> Two thousands. It's a weird stuff. Was this house even built? Well, I guess it's a TV show, so it must have been. That's the thing. Like um, houses. I mean, yeah, obviously there were houses built in two thousands, but like typically, like you're living in a house that was built in, you know, earlier than that, or like the. I, you know, how the percentage of people living in a house that actually was built in two thousands, um, it's probably pretty low. Right? Um, you could try the yellow cabinets from the uh, dream. Did that look too modern though? If we want wood cabinets. People redo their kitchens all the time. That's true. That's true. There's an ad. There's an ad right now. There is. I didn't have my ad thing set up, which is bad on me. Um. Oops. My mom's, my mom's house was built in 2003. I know um, what it should look like. Okay, there we go. Should we try again with that thing then? Oh, to replicate the lip. Right, okay, I see what you're saying. Okay. Oh, uh, okay. But okay. Oh yeah, maybe. Mm. Wait, hang on, if we have like the half ones maybe? Okay, the UI um is bonkers right now. I don't know if that's giving us the same look we want though, I'm Maybe. <laughs> Sexy beast Everything is broken. And 20 used that which prime. Everything seems to be a little broken. <laughs> um, thank you, Sexy Beast. Appreciate that. Uh... Right, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me lift him up a little bit. Uh... Is it framey? Oh boy. Uh, that needs to be that one. That should work now. Let's see. It's good for you. Okay, get her. I mean, the alerts are just completely gone wrong. You know, it's fine. Next week, they may be fixed. I don't know. Well, I appreciate that. Thank you so much for me. I appreciate that. Thanks so much for that. And uh, thank you everyone for being patient with me today. I feel like everything's kind of going wrong. But you've all been so patient. Now, I don't know if we're going to keep this. I don't know if we love this. But if we do, it could be fun. Janky alerts are the best alerts. <laughs> I don't want to be known for my janky alerts, though. Or do I? This is going to be very difficult. Wait, why is that now? Wait, what? 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 Oh, no. <sighs> Let's 
I'll do all of them and, sp and then rotate them. I think that's what that's what you probably just said just now, right? Please read me. Uh, you could put a wall there, place the cabinets, then a race. Oh, that is also a good idea, Lily. That's also a good idea. That would probably be a better idea than I'm doing right now. Um, <laughs> that is also a good idea. How does this look? Kind of the line there, but I don't know. I don't know if we love it. But tall is so fun. It is. It is. La la la. What do you think of that? You can hate it. You can hate it. It's cool. It's okay. Meh. Yeah. Uh, if the overlap. Uh, if I overlap it though, it's gonna have that little flicker, that annoying like flickering bin, you know? Raise it, raise it up a bin. Let me try Lily's way with the with the wall. The issue that I'm having is that. The fridge with like this one on top is taller than this thing. I feel like this thing should have just been a slightly bit taller. That way you could have a fridge, you could have a cabinet on top of the fridge, and then it all matched up. But that's not the case. You know, it has to be like that, which is now it's floating a bit down there. I mean, unless I put like the counter in there like that, which I guess doesn't look too bad. Okay, well, we'll give it like that then. Okay, so we're gonna try this. Hmm. Quite better if it snaps in. I just thought this is a good idea. I think we just abandon this idea. Let me, let me try. Let me try the uh, tall, the taller ones. It was kind of a cool idea, but I also think it's not really working. What do you think of it? You know, obviously if it was like not lines along it, I think it would be much nicer. Just try the wall as, it, as uh, you were doing. Like I did originally. It looks a bit odd. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. For sure, for sure. So go back to my wacky idea. <laughs> well, well, well. Looks like Dr. Gluon maybe was onto something originally. Hmm. <laughs> this is also looking kind of goofy too, so... <laughs> well, yeah, I didn't explain it! I felt like it would speak for itself. I felt like the amazingness of it all would just, like, speak for itself. You know what I mean? Like, you would just be, like, in awe of it, and then... And then, you know... You'd all just like, this is amazing. Um, I'm also not 100% sure this is even going to work.
So there's that factor as well. You know, we shrink those down. Um, how do you feel about that? I've just got a fun, you know. Use the wide door from Dream Home. Wait, which one is that one? The wide door. The wide. Use these wide sliding doors. This one? These ones are too small. The Batu. The, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was thinking that. Uh, is that a debugger? Yeah, yeah. There's, there's like what, that one really big door. And it's in Batu. Is Batu going to save us here? It's a debug. The debug dorm. Uh, why do you want a wall around? This kind of frames it. Also, I'm kind of looking at this picture as inspiration. You know how it's like in a cubby. So we've got this wall coming down. I wish we could just do this. You can do half walls, but you can't do half walls on top. You know? Eco living. Oh, you think of the one from Eco living? Let me see. Let me see, check this Batu one. This one. That's too big. That was too big. Okay. Um, Eco living. Platforms raised up, but they don't raise down. You know, we can't have a platform way down from the ceiling. You know. Are you... Wait, which one do you mean? Oh, one of these. Oh, yeah, actually, this one might work. Well, is it... I think this is not tall enough. I can't actually... You know, I can't actually increase the size of a hole. Uh, maybe that's okay. Uh, thank you so much for that. Uh, Marseille 6,393. Yeah, the UI is so broken. Months, I don't know what's going on. Taking advantage of the six-month September subscription deal. Appreciate Let's that. Go. Let's go. Do you like that? Uh? That's another question. Is it usable? We're gonna have to, gonna have to play test it. Yeah. Um, do you like it though? Like, I mean, I know it looks the best we've got so far, but is it actually worth it? Yeah, but Spandau, they, they don't look as good though. They, you know, like for those, we only have to, we can only we have to use these things. What if I want, like, a straight wall up here, do you know? If they had these, but it was a wall, then yes, I would like it. But, like, which one would I use to get that look? I guess I kind of wish it was a little higher, but, I mean... Okay. The cats and dogs one? Let's see, which one's that one? That's this one. Um, you also don't see it when you have uh, walls down. So um, they're kind of pointless when you play like this. You have to have the walls up to see them. You know? Oops. I do, you though? Yeah. They like disappear. So, um, um, I never really use them because you never see them. With a half wall, it won't work. Yeah, it won't work with a half wall too. <clears throat> yeah, but you don't see them when you have half when you have um 
and this display mode. So anyway, let's uh let's um make this go away. We're not gonna make it go completely away because I'm I'm afraid if this doesn't work, we're gonna have to like we're gonna have to like get it back. You could just kind of see it itty bitty down there. Okay. So now, can we can this can we like use the oven? Like cook with? Can I just cook alone? A mouse door, right? Do a test here. Well, does that work? <laughs> well, that was twenty minutes. We'll never get back. <laughs> um. <laughs> it might work with an archway instead of a door. Yeah, but I want to get that look though. Why? It's because you can't like open the door. <laughs> Even an archway as well. Yeah, but that would that would be an archway looking thing. Yeah. So. It's all good. It's all good. Um, then oven will work. We want one. Save space with stand alone thing. Check the un unfilled wall sign. Is that what it's called? La, 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 la. Oh, this thing. Oh, does it come in yellow? No, because I'm white. It's an idea. I don't know. I think we'll just leave it. I think we'll just leave it alone. Uh, I mean, I can struggle to replicate that all day long. And I think it would just look, it just won't look as good, you know? So, um, it is what it is. We'll uh, move ahead. We'll keep moving ahead. Do, 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 do. Just do another layer of cabinets. Yeah, like along top here. Maybe we could do like this. Well, maybe not that shelf. So there's a thing in the middle there. A different kind of shelf. Does this one have a similar wood color? That might look okay. It kind of frames it in a way, you know? Is it jankily built? Slightly jankily built? La 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 That looks pretty good. We could maybe put some knickknacks along the top, you know? Some plates? Yeah. <laughs> no, I'm not lately. <laughs> I was done before the stream. Um. <laughs> I want to look good. Yeah, it's a plate along top. Yeah. I like, um, I like the shelves in the window here. I mean, that's kind of fun. A fun look, you know? <coughs> I don't know if we want to do that as well. <laughs> of course, I can't have the plates. The well, I got the plates. Is that like a glass shelf? 
do 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 It's given the illusion. Oh yeah, it does give the illusion. That's true. That's true. I know I think this is good. I think this is good. Maybe we could even do like Shove down there as well. Um, yeah, like little jars and things. Little jar and stuff and things. Also, maybe I'll do like... I don't know if it's kind of fancy, but we could do like this and then rotate it. Do these rotate them? Oh, we can't say that on stream, Saffron, okay? You can't say that. <laughs> hey, Colored Heart, thank you so much for the 17 moms. Colored Heart underscore under the Fez for Just imagine, months. just imagine Peacock. the Fez gluing, flying on the screen. In a spectacular scene. That's amazing. Thank you, Cutter Heart. Appreciate that. Uh, I kind of like the way it sticks out on both ends, though. I don't know if that's 2000s in style. Um. But I like the way it does that. Wow, what a spectacular fez throw! Thank you. <laughs> Imagine all the fezzes flying across the screen. Like spectacular show. <laughs> it's gonna be fixed. We're gonna fix it. It's gonna look amazing. I would change the window out for this window. Curtain in here. Hey, film, have a good night. Thanks for being here, buddy. Yay! Did Take care, buddy. How about some hanging plants beneath the shelf in front of the window? Yay! Okay, yeah. Chronicles MZ to cheer to yeah. 300. It looks good. I like this kitchen version better, to be honest, Glue Bongo. That's great. I'm glad. You like the fake window? Yeah, me too. Was it like it's a little, just a little one? That's not a good style, is it? I mean, that's not really what we're going for, is it? Why? Why do you snap? Why would you snap there? You, you, you're not even up to the, the window. So maybe we're doing like a little thing here, you know? Just like a little thing. Like this, but maybe not as big. I don't know about this one. La 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 la. La 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 la. Is that a good? <laughs> Let's say it's both, okay? <laughs> no curtains, just plants. No curtain, just plants. Plants are good. Got this one.
What are we dropping it down by? 0.5? No. Let's say it dropped down by 1. What do I do here? I have to do for all of them. Uh, not quite 1, but close. 0.9. Is that too low, though? Is that like, is that plant too low? It can go low, 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 low. Jossie, thank you. Oh, I can make it smaller. Cheered X1000, Hollow Dock, and Glue Beans. I have been watching all the VODs, so glad I can actually be here live. Thank you Aww. for being my stress relief. I love the Glue Bees and Doc Spanter. Glue Hug. Aw, oh, thank you, Jossie. I'm glad you're enjoying the VODs. Oh, that's a bit better. A bit smaller. Bits in there nicely. Uh, anything else? Hanging. Couple of these, maybe. Be a couple of these. Different colors, though. Thing. That's good. Everyone looking at her. Couple bottom jeans. <laughs> um, it needs a bowl of fruits. Um, and a ceramic animal. Okay, okay. Can you but you say or or and? La, 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 la. Make one smaller. Make one of these smaller. Just a smidge smaller or. Oops. It's too small. And <laughs> all. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. There's a thing there, you know? Pots and pans on the island. It's got, yeah, it's gonna come out soon. We'll, we'll, we'll just play the fishing touching on it. Um, couple bottom jeans, boots with the fur, with the fur. Vladdy's looking at her. Um, <laughs> you need all the weird bottles and things from Dine Out. Yeah, put it all over the place. <laughs> Roosters. Meow, 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 meow. What are these? Wait, what are these? Oh, these are like messages. <laughs> these are like bottles, uh, messages in the bottle. Actually, no, that's kind of cute, though. You want pickle jars and things, though, right? The honors from Dine Out. Big wooden salt and pepper grinder. Is that um is that like 
Is that like in the um Is that in the game? Oh, you mean this thing? Lemons and limes. Any copper brass things in the game? Just a big old thing of chilies for some reason. I just kind of wanted it to look like we robbed a pier one, you know? This is the vibe. Right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Do we have any of that stuff though? There's a lot of salt and pepper things. Those things. I'll tell you what, I'll tell you what. Um. Does someone want to put together a a knickknack wall? Oh no! Oh, I I got one of those on Monday. I got a double. I got doubles. I got the flu and the booster. So, um, um I got double shots coming up. On Monday, um, but it'd be good because then I'll be like uh, uh, well off for um, TwitchCon. This is why I'm getting it. It's Twitch TwitchCon's coming up, and there's gonna be a lot of people there, and I want to make sure I'm, uh, you know, I'll be mass and stuff. But you know, you gotta protect yourself, right? Uh, so, um, oh. Yeah, but he's a thing, Chronicle. I feel like if I don't give him the same arm, then I'm gonna have two sad arms. The top row, fifth item over. Oh, oh gosh. Not like literally the top. I'm like, okay. <laughs> um. Where was it now? <laughs> What was it now? Dang it, Doc. I went all the way up. <laughs> Lindsay Swatsky used their Twitch Prime. Yeah, you scrolled. Sorry, I thought you meant like the top of the thing. Like it's on the top. Thank you, Lindsay. Second row. One, two, three, four, five. This thing? Oh. It's in a box, though. Where would I put this? Where would this go? What are you thinking for this one? We're getting like a brown, like the, um, the kitchen is now. Under here or like above the door, maybe? <laughs> Everywhere. Put it inside the, uh, the shelving area or inside here. Does that look weird, though? Would that look weird? Sandstorm 8806 used the Sandstorm. Hey, Doc. Hey. The build looks good. Thank you. Everyone is having a good evening or day. I took my kids to the zoo today. Oh, nice. Fun. That's awesome. That's snapping. I really wish I couldn't have it not snap. Make it one size smaller. Let's see. I don't know. It looks weird with a frame around it. I even have to cover up the entire thing. Or we can make a little, like, fit it in there. Like, it's. This portion has, like, a. Um, a wood back, you know? Put those up there for now. Hmm. <laughs> I, I could move the shelf down. I could move the shelf down. Let's 
7 I hope we feel better soon, Emmeline. I'm going to put some of these bottles up here. You know? That's those are from um, the wedding pack. I said we're just killed by a media? Really? That's awesome. I mean, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for your loss. You're building a knickknack shelf, yeah. I think that's pretty good. Well, I'm died of a media. Is that good? Oh yes, send me that, and I can like. Just send me like a bunch of knickknacks in a room and I will, um, you know, I will build them. Let's try and get this floor. Let's try replicating this floor here. And also I like the, I like the towels right here. So we can do that as well. Um, also, we have a window here. Maybe we can do that. Um, not window, but door them. We have doors in this game, so... Do we have that door though? Like a sliding door thing? Maybe. Um, like that door. That's not see-through though, is it? Like that, but see-through. Do we not have that door? Hmm. What door do I use over here? Oh yeah, like this door? Oh boy. Don't remember that. Don't remember that one. It's not quite the door I want, but it's the door we have, so... And then they have curtains in front, which we do have those curtains. So... I was looking at those earlier. Hmm. 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 No, I don't know. I don't know. They quite look good. <laughs> Perfect. That looks so good. Um. I don't like them. I don't like them. Let me this, let me this one. Maybe like that one. I'm trying to get this door look. But when we don't have that door, for some reason, and we couldn't come like that, but I'm, I'm not finding them in a pinch. With this music, I could build for hours, right? It's very, ins it's very inspirational. <laughs> let's do it, Abe. Yay! Walking the country, my brother. Let's see how Merlin's doing. There are variants on this on the door. You mean? Oops. Hold on. Or this. I 
the season's dole. So that does on cats and dogs. Let's see what season's dole look like. The high school curtains, maybe. Okay, let's have a look. Oh, this is a season's door. I mean, yeah, I guess I, I guess I kind of like that door better. Oh, I, this curtains are way too fancy. Um, the get to work door comes in white. Okay, let's have a look. And then you said for the windows. High school pack. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is what we want. This is it. This is, our, this is what we want, totally. That is that That is that one. And then for the curtains, we do... We check out the high school one. Well, it's kind of inspired by... Um, a cooking show. Because we've got, like, the way it's laid out. Like, the, um... The layout is kind of designed like a cooking show. But we're trying to go with the a 2000s style kitchen. Oh, like these ones? Yeah. We shrink them a smidge, you know? And then lower them down a bit. Change the color. What do you think of that chatter? Save it. That's seven. Can I eh on these ones? I could probably take that door out, honestly. I don't know what we would put there instead, but we could take the door out and then have another door. We have, we have a door right there. And then that would give us more room for potentially more, like, you know, shelvings and stuff. Or something else. Maybe like um, a cornery one. Could go in there like this. I don't know. Pantry door. Fly door right there, Well, we have a door there. So, if this door works, they can go out there and go in there. A herb rack? I never heard of it before. Um. An archway into a pantry. Oh, that could be cool. I like that idea. We make a single type pantry look okay. Yay! That kind of fits our Tuscany kind of setup rhyme. It's under the Dr. Glue and tag. Oh, nice. And Olive, Garden vibes. Olive Garden vibes. I know Firefly is also making it, so I'll also see what they're doing. So I'll get both of yours in a second here. Do, do, do. Thank you so much for doing that. Uh, that is cool. I like that idea. Um, I don't know what we're going to put in there, but... Bunch of shelves, maybe? A bunch of shelves in a better space than what we got going on? Oh, gosh. I can't build it there. Can we build it this angle? So this is fine. As soon as I go from here, it goes out here. I 
don't know what would go in there, but I do like it. Yeah, a little pantry. Um, soup and salad. Okay, let's try. Let's change the floor here to be more like that Tuscany style, which is like tiles and stuff. Just kind of losing the inspiration image here to uh, let's copy that. Should I think the whole like living room have it step up to the kitchen? <laughs> yeah, no, I realize that. The jungle adventure tiles. Let's have a look. Yeah. It's up? Okay. What do you call it? What do you call yours? Did you both tag Dr. Glow on it? I tagged Dr. Glow on Did you tag Dr. Glow on yours, uh, Blood? Let's, let's go here. It's very alt. Well, that's perfect. Sweet. Let's see what you both did. Let's see what you got. Thank you for doing that, by the way, both of you. It makes it easier than me just being like... Uh, and you're like, this one. And I'm like, what one? This is Fireflies one, right? Let's see how much stuff was added <laughs> to the to the uh, gallery since so you both added stuff in sweet let's have a look knickknacks ooh I like these pans and stuff we got the chicken we gotta have the chicken why is that like snapping okay Are you, uh, are you get to be in MCC? I have no idea. I don't know. Oh, uh, well, we just had one. Uh, maybe next Yet time. One under the fest for 41 Whenever months, Zeus tells me I'm in one. Months. Yeah. <laughs> also, uh, it's my birthday this week. Oh, happy, happy birthday to you. September babies. Blue, yay. Uh, I, I am, I am always happy to be in the MCC when I'm invited. But, um, you know, um, there's so many awesome people in the MCC. And so, uh, you know, when they get, uh, when they get a chance, let them, let them go. But if they ever ask, I'm definitely down, you know, I'm definitely down. Sim is the best part. <laughs> I know Zeus has been like, has been practicing so hard. And I'm um, very proud. Me, I'm just here to have fun when I'm in there. Big spoon. My spoon is too big. My spoon is too big. Anyone know what I'm talking about? Does anyone get that? Does anyone get that? Hopefully someone. Hopefully someone. You do. You do get it. Okay, good. <laughs> I'm 26. 
<laughs> Eerie what I had no idea. That which prime? Hi. <laughs> Thank you so much for the free months. Appreciate that. My spoon is too big. And then he says other things that I can't see on stream. Um, throwback, yeah. I went to a, an animation festival in um, in San Francisco once, and uh, John, John Lasseter was there. He was one of the judges. It was pretty sweet. I got to, I got to say hi. I totally said hi. Explain. It's an animation. If you search... Probably, probably if you go to... If you, I'm a banana! If you go to um, YouTube and search my spoon is too big, you're gonna see a very, uh, you'll see a cartoon that's very poorly animated and also is not for kids at all. Do not watch it with the kids. Do not watch it with the kids. I beg you. <laughs> it's not a kid's, <laughs> it's not a kid's cartoon. Um. <laughs> it's a big spoon. So, Z3R01. Zero zero one. One Thank you so much for that. Uh, it's amazing. 26. I'm 26! Um Yes, do not look it up. Yes, do not look it up. It's very crude. It's very silly. <laughs> Everything's can go in here. more I want to do it. It's not that bad, but it's, you know, still not sure what kids are doing. I don't know. The kids these days got all kinds of things going on YouTube, so maybe it's not that bad. My kids watch all kinds of questionable things on the internet. Now, where could this go? This is cool, but I don't want to put it. Maybe above the microwave? Right there? Above the door. Yeah. yeah, it's probably tame now. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's probably his tame. <laughs> I like the uh, I like these. the fall off the counter. Rejector came out in 2000s. That could be a fun fact. There we go. So there we go. We got a reference to rejected cartoons. My spoon is too big. Uh, <laughs> um, I wonder if we may have crossed paths at a, cer at a certain animation festival in San Francisco. Um, because I'm a fan of, um, oh yeah, and Billy's Balloon, yeah, maybe, if you're gonna, if you're going to them in this, in 2000s, Yay! it was in, um, it was down at, uh, one of them I went to was down at, um, I met John Lasseter, it was in, um, uh, forget it's one of the districts. I forget the name of it. It's off of State Street. Uh, thank you so much for that. Why don't you have... Why don't you have the puppet show? Oh, like, there's a thing listed. Um, my computer's having a lot of problems right now, so I'm kind of like... 
trying to not do too many things. Uh, thank you so much for that. 29 months. Cool. As you can see, months. alert's not even working either. <laughs> thank you so much for the 29 months. I appreciate that. <laughs> Case in point. <laughs> I went to, so here's a fun fact. I went to school and was good friends with uh somebody who ended up working for Pixar. And that guy is the guy who directed Toy Story 4. And it's really weird to see him like in like during interviews and stuff. When that movie's coming out. I do, I do. At the time, well, I mean, when when um when he got the job at Pixar, that's kind of like when we lost contact because they they were very like we can't be on social media. I don't know if they they probably have to be on social media, so. He probably is on there now. I don't know, but like, the time like he could be on there. Twenty-five months. Thank you so much. Um, so, um, we just kind of lost contact. Do you like it? Find, find some knickknacks in there. What is that? What is that? Here we go now! Ad is starting in two minutes, by the way. Just so you know. Don't, don't, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. It's happening. Don't worry about it. There we go. <laughs> Computer. For it. There we go. <laughs> um, what a moment to walk in on. You got a laugh, Lily. You got a laugh. You know what I mean? You got a laugh.
This is a Sims 2 soundtrack, yes. What is a Sims 5 soundtrack gonna sound like? <laughs> You're welcome. What is a Sims 5 soundtrack gonna sound like? Oh, um, there's gonna be an ad playing soon. Uh, there's gonna be an ad playing real soon, just so you know. I won't see anything funny when the ad's playing. It's gonna be dubstep. <laughs> Can you imagine? The TikTok sounds. I can't wait to hear it. I'm not gonna say anything funny when the ad's playing, okay? K pop, let's go. First time I saw you do um, that, I lost my mind. <laughs> we should make that a request. We should make the Bob the Bob the Bob song a request. Lily, do you mind finding it for me? The ad has started. Let's see what we're gonna do. We're gonna do some charades. We're gonna do some charades, okay? Little while. I'm gonna do a charade I can do. Charade time. Um. Okay. Okay. Sure. Sure. This is, going, this is going to get me banned on Twitch. Here we go. Ready? Yes, yes, milkshake. You got him. Here we go. Here we go. Yes, yes. Singing in the shower. And for those who are on ad break who may have been playing along but couldn't hear me, the first one was. What was the first one? What was the first one, Chan? Milkshake. Milkshake and then singing in the shower. Hang on, I gotta sneeze. Ready? Uh, 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 I can't! Good. <laughs> you gotta laugh. You gotta laugh. <laughs> um, cool. Is this kitchen good? We have this kitchen. We love this kitchen. Um, I know the door needs to be moved over slightly. Like them. Is the door functional? Let's save this. For the fairs. It's fabulous. Fabulous kitchen. 
was it based on? Well, it's kind of a based on Tuscan style kitchen, which is apparently um, the style of the 2000s. But we also went with a TV show um, look. I'm going to take one of these. I'm going to take one of these uh, things Lily made. Lily, I can't pick it up. That would have put one back there. We gotta send that to uh for you. That mod. Um it's kind of a, not my problem. It's kind of based on a Tuscany style kitchen, but also the layout is designed in a way to look like it's a TV show, like a TV cooking show. Right? So we got the you know the thing there, and then you know. You hate it. Why? Cabinets above the island? Oh, cabinets? Oh, um... Above here? Uh, I think that would kind of will block stuff. Maybe I'll do one of these, though. I don't know, that's kind of blocking, too. Thank you, Lily. Is that too much in the way? Does that feel too crowded with that there? I hate it because it looks too nice. <laughs> they said they have it, they don't hate it. <laughs> well, that's a lot different. You have it, you don't hate it. <laughs> I'm like, dang. I'm sorry, Lily, but I like it. I don't know what I'm for you saying. <laughs> um, oh, um, do you think... Uh, do you think the kitchen should be on a different level, slightly, like a, like a step up from the uh, from the living room? Do you think that's? Uh, do you think we need to do that? <laughs> yeah, Doc starting some drama. <laughs> do you think so or no? No, just leave it as is. Yes, yes, no, no, maybe, sure, yes, no, yes, maybe, sure, yes, yes. Okay, we're gonna go. Hold it. Let me do it, and then you can all see it. Because you may, I may do it, and all those yeses become a no. You know, You're like, oh, don't like that. Um, let's put a temporary fence down. While we do this, it's probably easier if I raise that up than raise that down. I got an award for doing that. Okay. I just messed all my things up, didn't it? I just messed all my things up, didn't it? I just messed all my things up. You know what? I think it's fine the way it is. I'm gonna, I'm gonna vote no on that. Ugh. I think it looks great. Okay, now. Um... Upstairs, kids' room. This is gonna be a fun thing to uh, gut. You have to delete all these. Kids are no longer in into Buzz Lightyear. Oops. I have to redo things equals veto. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> ah, some of those are cute. We'll leave those there. Okay. Bedroom done. <laughs> we get Dragon Ball Z. Oh, Pokemon. Kids love the Pokemon. One second, I'll be right back.
the Pocket Monsters. Digimon. We are. We are. B R. We are. We are. B R. Can we do VR Troopers? Can we do VR Troopers? Is Doc a void critter when he goes into the... Yes. We are. We are. B R. Blues clues for the toddlers. Do we have some inspiration for the kids' rooms? All vanilla wolf themed. Transformers. Teletubbies. Look at the Blues Clues uh, room. Squallen. Um, hello. Oh, there goes. The Wiggles. Let me get Sims 1 themed. I'm gonna get Sims 1 theme and everything can be on fire. You are. Kin Possible Bedroom. Here we go. Lily, wait! I haven't loaded yet. Um. <coughs> That's him. It. It's a bit bland, though, isn't it? A Blues Clues or Pokemon? Webkins? Can't possible. A Harry Potter bedroom? Transformers movie came out in 2007. Oh my gosh, are you serious? For some reason, that makes me feel very sad. No, 2007, really? Um, a Pokemon room. We can do like a we can do like a blues clue not blues clues like a void critter kind of thing. Thomas the Tank Engine. Um Bucket Hat Boys Band poster. Do 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 Club Penguin. Yeah. Uh, the first and only Transformer movie came out in 1986. I don't think I've seen that one. I've already seen the, uh, what's his name? Shia LaBeouf one. Monsters, Inc. was 2001. That is true. Phineas and Ferb. Bright colors for the toddlers. Bright and bold. Perfect. Fearless spike. Um, I could months. create a Pokeball or something right here. Maybe. I could maybe create a Pokeball. Brats! Yeah? <laughs> Do it. Do it, Dark! I mean, maybe. We've got those half. Depends what colors he's coming. Yeah, we could do it. We could, we could do a Pokeball right here. Big old Pokeball. Kids love Pokemons. He's a little bit of one. Connection cheered X200. Lily suggested booze room from Monsters Incorporated. That oh, yes, yeah, true. So, so no Pokeball then, or cause. The older kids. True. Though their room is a lot smaller and a lot more. Uh, not a lot of room in there to do anything that creative. Um, did you put something in the thing, Lily?
That's cool, boom. That's cool. Got the TV in there. Do, 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 do. Is it right here? I like the stripes. Put the teens down the basement. Change it up. We could do a poem. We could do a poem. I want to do what I feel like is good, though. Let's try this one. Um, maybe we could do uh, a teen room in the basement. Mike Wazowski. Do we have any pink stripes? What do I gotta do myself? Pastel stripes in. Yeah. There's a wallpaper one. There's that one. This one coming in whites. Why does it not come on? I show shows pink. Cause I only look for one. Cause I look for the paints. Is that why? Cause I look for the paints. Nope. Pink and white, though. It's like pink and dark pink. And that just feels like old granny house to me. It looks less kids room to me. Why not pink and whites? Why not pink and whites? There's more than that. Over all the things. Do, do, do. Zip. Is everything this category is pink? The ghost wall because of boo. In the early 2000s, I was working for Time Warner and we got ATT for free. We were getting, uh, and we we're still getting ripped off. I never had. AT and um, AOL. I never. Gray and white. That's not a good one. That's not, that's not, that's not a dirty one. Like that one? And I still think it has the same, like, funness. I don't hate that. I mean, it looks like ice cream. Ice cream. Ice cream. Ice cream. Right. My pets still have the old AOL email, yeah? Just Melili cheered X200. You've got mail. You've got mail. You've got mail. Mm. Ice cream, ice cream, ice cream, chillin'. Uh, uh, uh. If the beds were light colors, it would look great. Yeah. There's already so many like layouts of this room we can do. Um, and I think what we have is probably the best for layout. I mean, we could do like this. We could go back to having the beds on this side. But, but I like having the tent up here. I mean, we could do like the beds here. Uh, is that weird though? 
ICQ? I had ICQ. I had ICQ. That was a that was a uh, a direct messenger program. So you could DM me. But it wasn't DM me back then, it was ICQ me. Send me an ICQ. I don't know, what, what, what did we say? It wasn't DM me. We, no one was slipping into the DMs back then. Yeah, I never used AOL. Oh no, I think I had an AOL, like, not like a, um, I had like an AOL messenger account. I am me. I am me, yeah, it's a message me. Yeah, ICQ is great. Love how creative you are with uh, your builds all the time. Make me wanna, yeah, thank you. Thank you so much for that. You say I am me? DM me's better. Aim me, I remember that one. People would always ask me A L uh, L A, what was it? A L L. E oh, no. ASL, that's it. Yeah. What does that mean? What does that mean, Chad? What does that mean? What does that mean? <laughs> Is it anyone not know what that means? ASL? <laughs> PM mean? It means. Uh, it's a uh, age, sex, location. <laughs> How old are you? Who are you? Where are you? <laughs> <laughs> At my desk, yeah. Yeah. Um, American Sign Language. <laughs> All Sims living. Yep. Planet Earth. There we go. Early days of the internet. Um, so we don't want this room, right? Let's do another 10. I like the tens. Tens are great. Oh, my, 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 my mind. <sighs> Alright, enough sharing your age, Chad. You're gonna get in trouble. The mods are mad at me right now. Don't, don't tell me your age. Thank you. I don't want to know. I don't want to know. I don't want to know. Um, show me tense. Yes, please don't do that. I'm sorry. That was my fault. That was on me. I take full responsibility. Mods, that was my fault. That was my fault. <laughs> Bad me, please. Dang it, glue on. Um, for some reason, I thought we had a different style of this tent. We don't, do we? Just have this one. Mm. Bad glue on. Put the dollhouse up here. They always destroy the dollhouse, though. But it's, as case in point, um. You like the white one? Yeah, I could set some, uh, it's okay. I wish we had like a pink one. I don't know, what should we do, Corgi? Uh, let, let me just say something about the age, just so I, I, I say this before. I just want to make sure we're okay with that. Um, and again, it was my bad because I mentioned it. I take full responsibility. It was my bad. Um, Ms. Dev, thank you so much. Hang on. Welcome to the first captain. Um, we don't want to talk about age because here's the thing. We don't want to normalize it. 
you don't want to make it normal for people to share their age in here because even though you may be like, well, I don't care because I'm like a certain age, right? But if you share your age, then someone who maybe shouldn't be sharing their ages thinks it's okay to, and then they share their age. And then, you know, people on the internet, sometimes they're going to, you know, come out the shadows and start DMing them. And I just want to make sure everyone's protected. So... That's why. It's my fault. I shouldn't say anything. But that's why we, that's why we, uh, that's why that wall is a thing. You know? I just want to kind of keep everyone safe. From, you know. <laughs> no, we're not. <laughs> Doom, 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 doom. We'll just try to protect you. All right. Anyway, let's um, let's do this. I don't know this bed. Um, let's let's figure what we got here. No worries. <laughs> Thank you for all understanding. It's kind of a world throughout Twitch. Uh, okay. Um, hmm. It'd be kind of nice if we had something like, like, and like a nicer bed. You know? A couple of these could be really, could be like cute, you know? We don't have that, that window there. Probably should have some kind of window, but not really not that big a window. Well, that's what we're kind of inspired by, but it doesn't have to necessarily be that. Huh? Is that okay? Maybe it would work if we had like that, and they can kind of go in there like that. Huh? A lot of uh, kids drawing on the walls. Yeah. Yeah, you know what? Like a like um, a kid's art table would be cute as well. It's pretty dark in here. Glow the dark st uh, stars. Um, I don't know. Is there? Put a bed against the wall. Put the get beds against the wall. Oh, you mean like this? Like that? We could do that. But then we're kind of viewing it like this, most likely. Um... The tent is so big that you won't be able to see it. Be, you won't be able to see anything behind the tent. If we put it close to the camera. Um, you know? Um, Doors from the parenthood uh, with the white and flowers like Boo's room. Okay, so long. Yes, let's just move on for the age talk, peeps, okay? Don't even joke about it. We just don't want to mention it. Everyone here is 26 and we'll move on, okay? Please don't joke about it. Uh. This one. This one? Yeah. The door is cute. Um... 
I don't know. Do you like the beds like this, or should we go back? I feel like I feel like the beds like this. A bit weird. And then I was thinking, I put the beds like this, and then I put like a little um, art set down here. I think that'll be good. Some kind of like a little art set. Or the art table, you know. Oh, the toddlers can't use that. Oh, yeah, but kids could use it though. What can toddlers use? Boom. You just watch a lot of anime, yeah. A dollhouse. Yes, sure, I could do that. That's the table right there. A toy chest. A potting. Um, because like Boo has a little art easel. I like the little tea set. That's kind of cool. We don't have any of that in the game, do we? There should be a stuff pack dedicated for toddler stuff, you know? You know what I mean? Like a stuff pack that's just for toddler stuff. Ah, I don't know, a guy can dream, right? Um, a guy can dream. Uh, that's all your thing glue on. Um, yeah, but it's all outside things. Except for the ball pit. Like, who puts a ball pit outside? Oh. <laughs> It's got it in, and I'm digging The Sims uh, 2 music. Thank you. You mean like toddler stuff bag? Yeah. No, it does have the coolest lights. Who put the ball pit outside? Oh, the balls are just like grossly floating when it rains. No toy chest, I will delete everything out, but free toys. It's more fun for them to have it in the Yeah, true. First time in this chat, and I uh, like it here. Hey, well, I'm glad you like it. Thanks, thanks for being here. Wait, oh, is that CC? Mm. Leapfrog? Was that 2000s? Uh, I know this isn't for toddlers, but I don't know. It's kind of cool. It's kind of a cute thing to put in here. I don't know what to put in here. I could construct a whole a whole fort out of pillows. Wasn't I building that one point? Kind of gave up, up on that. And I was building a uh, a pillow castle <laughs> because it looked terrible. Is why I stopped building him. Um. Hang on, maybe we can like, maybe we can fake a little table, a little tea, a tea, uh, a tea party table, you know? Oh, oh, that's, um, that's not a stall. Do they still on that? Can they still on that thing? Oh, no, never mind. Spins Floating baby! For 19 months. Um. <laughs> uh, I thought it was like a little table, a little chair. I was hoping. Uh, thank you so much, Spence. Appreciate that. Um, okay, stand up. Get off of there. I guess all chairs have to be that height. They should have like chairs that only toddlers can use. Oh my goodness, floating baby. I mean, it's a, it's a seat, but um, maybe I shrunk it down. I don't know. They can you just sit on that 
they can usually sit on that through uh, through the other one. Try. We what? Try what? So which one? The animal chair. I think the orange play table is for toddlers. What pack does that come in? Oh, the pillow? Oh, the little poof? They can sit on the, the, um... I don't think they can sit on the pillow. I don't think anything can happen with the pillow. Pillows do nothing. Yeah, but they're all gonna be the same size, though. It doesn't matter what I put down, it's all gonna be that same size. It's not gonna be like a little one. It's gonna be, you know... It's gonna be a chair made for an adult, but a kid can use it. All the chairs are the same height for animation purposes. But I can, uh, we can have a look. See what's a good one for, like, little babies. Like, pillows would be okay, but you see how high they are. You know, I was kind of thinking, like, a little teeth head. I don't know why I was thinking that would work. Under the fest for 31 uh, oh, Stacy's, thank you so much for that. Uh, Okay, got a plan. This may look stupid, but I'm gonna gonna give it a go anyway. I'm gonna give it a go. Build them block table. Put <laughs> little bodies around. <laughs> yeah, that'd be perfect. Hang on, this may look stupid. I don't know. Let's try this. Oh, hang on. Let me just feed you. Oh gosh, you have any food? Please don't die, you're my tester. Okay, no, don't want, no one panic. Now, 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 if I take this, okay, and we take something like a table. Bear with me here. Perfect. Um, Surely we used their Twitch Prime. Bear with me. Uh, thank you so much for that. Uh, okay. Okay, hang on. What looks, like a, what looks like a little table? A little chair, I mean. It can't be a chair. It has to be not a chair. I guess that looks like a little chair. Okay. Right, now. Bear with me. Um, you don't want to sit there, did you? Because that thing's right there. Okay, that's fine, kid. Um... You have faith. Melt she won under the fest for twenty four months. Twenty four months. Mel. Awesome and wholesome community. Thank you so it much really for that. Uh, saving grace. Glue hug. Glue hug. Thank you so much for that. Uh. I don't know, but I'm gonna tone it down and see if it works. <laughs> Um, my alerts are just so blocked right now. Used their Twitch Prime. I'm gonna pause the alert. for the laughs during an incredibly stressful time. Oh, no worries. Uh, oh, dang it. Dang it. The bit, yeah, but they're all the same size, though. The problem with every chair in this game, even if it's like a kid's chair, they put them at the same height. They're all the same height. The bear chair, the pillows. Uh, oh my gosh, thank you so much for 10 gifted. Oh my gosh. Uh, I'm trying, I want to make like little chairs. This this might not work. The mushrooms. I think that, well, we can, actually we can try those. I did, yeah. The, I'm just like overly annoyed by my alerts right now. I'm overly annoyed by the alerts. Though there is a boost trade happening. Queen of Aliens, thank you so much for that. Uh, I want to see what happens if I take this and I lower it some, okay? Okay. Okay. Right. So we lower it by 
2.2? Okay. Boosting! Alright, and then we put like a little block under there or something. Um. Okay, 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 okay. Now does that work? Oh, the plant stand thing? That would be good too. Can you see it again? Oh my gosh, I'm a genius. Oh my gosh, I'm a genius. Yeah. Um. Hey, thank you so much. That we may we make a toddler float tomorrow. We're going to see what happens when we set something on fire. Um. Thank you for the 13 months as well. Appreciate that. And always, we got a boost train happening right now. If we get to level five and beat it, we're doing all the tag. You know. Scoot the kid back a bit. Yeah, he's sitting on a little poof ball. He's sitting on a little poof ball. Um. Mia, thank you for the 25 months. And, Je and Jen, thank you for the 23 months. Uh, Coco with 100 bits as well. Thank you so much for that. Uh, really appreciate that, peeps. Thank you so much. Uh, Doc and his yarn, Doc and his yarn balls. There ain't nothing we can do. Ain't nothing we can't do with yarn balls. I want to make a little tea set. It's a little tea thing. A little tea uh, thing. That's what we're doing. I want a little round table. Hmm. They were a fan of that being there, were they? Neo with the five bits there. Sock with the hundred bits. Thank you so much for that. Uh, Green circles. Thank you so much for the, that. Uh, Jen with the free gifted. Thank you so much. Uh, we're in a level four of the hype train. Very Alice in Wonderland. I'm gonna do like this one. These have four legs, I've always look weird. Um we're not going for weird. This might be weird though. Oh, it's gonna be weird. Um, this whole thing is weird. Do, 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 do. Weird is our middle name. Okay, so let's save this. Oh, thank you for those bits. Appreciate that. Um, we are level four of the hype chain. If we get to level five and beat it, we will do an auto tag. Uh, what beside the bed table? Um, <coughs> what if you use a bedside table instead? Oh, uh, maybe. Yeah, that might be better, actually. Good point. This is a bit thick. <coughs> Firefly, thanks for um, um, thanks for being here. At least it's be right back, so you'll be back. <laughs> oh, like this one? Yes, something like this. <coughs> what 
when I put the teapot on there, you can be like, oh, that's a cute glue on. If this works out. Uh, Neon, thank you so much for that gift as well. Appreciate that. Um, um, I just want the legs to go straight down. What can I find? Maybe this is one. Yeah, it's probably, this is probably a good one. This also might not work, so... Don't worry about that. Don't worry about that. I'm a professional. Who needs floor? I just watch them on YouTube. Hey, Barry, good to have you here. These do not need to be this size, but they probably should be some kind of size that they will actually like a click on them, you know? And then we take these ones, we move them down. How much did I bring it down by? I forgot. Point four. Nope. Point um two. Okay. To the yarn balls because. The thing about yarn balls is they don't really... The Sims don't care about the yarn balls. They don't get in the way of the animations. We could probably change those colors as well. And they look so cute. Okay. Sim, sit at that table on the chair. Oh my gosh, all the way downstairs. Trying to get food or something. Can these kids like not be so starving? Can you just eat this? Can you eat the food? I'm trying to test stuff here. And y'all hungry. Just gobble those in there, please. Right. Come up here. Sit there. Uh, it's a table you don't like. Sit there. Sit here. Sit here. Don't panic, everybody. Don't panic. It's a table. <laughs> Panicking! Don't panic. I got this. This will look, this will look good. Everyone's gonna be like, how do you do that? Is that CC? And I'm gonna be like, nope. That's just me being stupid. It's not the yarn, we just test with the yarn. I mean, if it is the yarn, then I don't know why it worked the first time. Sit. Sit here. 
don't, don't worry about that. It's cute. Don't worry about it. Yeah! Now toddlers can sit at the, the table. Maybe if we make the, um, the table just a little bit higher. And, um... And then we take these. We kind of scoot in. <laughs> you come with me, kid. I know that they will walk through the table to use it. But it's just so cute, you know? It's just so cute. Sit there. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> Scoot on in. I don't know. The funny thing is that like adults could also sit in these tables. There's like no reason why an adult couldn't sit in them. Tucking them in. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Scoop it on in, buddy. Okay. Um, and now. We get some tea, we get some teacups. Is it like play teacups? Is that like a thing? Was it like official teacups? Do we have play teapots and cups and things? <laughs> Straight legs, yeah. <laughs> they didn't graduate from leg school yet. Nope. Okay. That's, they should do that. They should do that. All right, they get a real tea bottle. Tea. This is like tea. Show me tea. Okay, we got it. Yeah. Actually, maybe. He's not gonna like that one. It's like, nope, that's where we kill it. That's, uh, that does be in right there. I don't know why, because technically. Should be okay right there. Yeah, now the little kids can have tea, tea parties. What do you think? Looks like he's about to fall off that, uh, of that, uh, ball there. <laughs> hang on. Is there one? Come over here. Oh, hang on, what are you doing? Okay, good. Really? A rat home? Uh, I think that's okay. We, I, don't, I don't think we need that one. Like, but <laughs> they should just be able to sit at it. Yay! Why won't you sit at it? Uh, oh no. Oh, look, it's sleeping at it. That's kind of weird. Oh, wait, nap. It's a nap. Sit. But I tested it. But I didn't test it when I tucked it in. Don't worry about that. Don't see that. That's spoiler alert. I didn't test it tucked in, um, 
Don't you dare deny it of Remy. I mean, if chat wants me to do it, put rat holes everywhere because that's when Ratatouille came out. I feel like most people are going to say no, though. Dang it, you liked it before. Oh boy, transformation is happening. <laughs> yup. Oh boy, well, we had it tested. Maybe they really can't be tucked in as much. It worked a second ago, though. This kid was all over it. Uh. A pet rat. Maybe when we get to 2007, we'll do that. You know, Monsters Inc. came out in 2001. We're not gonna have a pet monster anymore. That kid's like, I'm stuck in it now. You've trapped me in here. Okay, kids, don't panic. Look, you work, I set it up, and then you're like, nah, I don't want to work no more. The heck, the heck, game, the heck. We went all this trouble. They're just too close to each other. Is that what it is? Okay. Let's see if that works. Right, yeah, yeah. I think, that, I think they are too close together, like everyone was saying. Oh, I wouldn't. What happened here? Watch a compilation of uh, 2000 theme theme songs. Yeah, <clears throat> when did VR Troopers come out, Lily? Okay, 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 okay. Can you see this one? Oh, dang it. Okay. Like no glow on. It's too close. I have no idea what that show is. V R. B R Troopers 1990, 1994 Alright, sorry everybody I'm working on this whole thing but we gotta go back I gotta go back to 1994 I did not mention VR Troopers How did you all let me slip on that one? V R B R B You remember that? I don't know why, for some reason I get the VR Troopers theme song stuck in my head I didn't even watch that show. I didn't even watch that show. And yet, for some reason, every once in a while, I'm like, B R B R. <laughs> I'm like, Cyber Sims 5. When do you think it's coming out, Sam? When do you think it's coming out? I'll be excited when it comes out in like four years, three years, three years. It's not coming out anytime soon, I'll tell you that much. Okay. You sit in this chair. You sit in this chair. I had to go to start soon. 
Why? Can you sit in this chair? Does that chair work now? No, don't go anywhere. Is it because the wall, maybe? The game said no, dog. <coughs> but I said yes! We ain't gonna get a trailer. I tell you what we're gonna get. Okay, if we get a trailer, I'll be very excited for that. My my prediction is that we're gonna get a logo. I mean, that's what we're gonna get. I think we're gonna get a logo in October. It's gonna say Sims 5. And then you'll be like, you were so excited. Sims 5 is coming out. There's an ad. There was an ad. There was an ad. Um. Oh boy. I may have just. Um, where did the where did the baby go? Where did the baby go? Where did the baby go? I'm so committed to fixing this now. It consumes all. You sit at that seat. Sit there. Thank you. <laughs> Where did everyone go? <laughs> well, we got deleted. Whoa, what the heck? Um, before ya, yeah, I may have lost one of the children. It's not gonna be a problem. Alex has never seen. Oh, there Alex is. Okay, good. Look, they're having a tea party and they loving it. <laughs> they loving it. We're back from the ads. Here, here's, what, here's what's gonna happen. I'm, this is my prediction for Sims Five. They're gonna show a logo, and that's all they're gonna show. There we go. I don't think we're gonna see anything. Ah, maybe we'll see a pre-rendered logo, a uh, pre-rendered thing. Maybe we see like a pre-rendered thing. You, I hate you. Why? Why would you say that? Baby yeeted. All right, all the chairs work. Now, can um, can Miranda sit the chair? Let's see what happens when Miranda sits in the chair. I don't think they've... No, they've done some stuff. <laughs> uh, I like to be... Um, oh, because of the VR thing. We are. We are. You know what? You know what? Don't worry about that. Um, but the reality... If this gets me the... Uh, if this gets me a copyright claim, I'm gonna, be very, I'm gonna laugh, okay? Thank you, Lily. There we go. Are we ready? Are you ready for this? It's gonna be an ad. Okay, hang on. After the ad. If it plays. One second. Here we go. You're gonna love this. We are, we are, we are, we are, we are.
Virtual reality. This is going to be the soundtrack for uh, Sims 5. That's what this is. That's the soundtrack for Sims 5. Uh, <laughs> that was the greatest. That was great. We are. We are. B are. I told you. Hey, everybody. <laughs> Brad, if that gets copyright claimed, that's gonna be great. That's gonna be great. Sims VR, yes, into the metaverse. Yeah, that's what it's gonna be. That's what it's gonna be, people. I'm telling you, everyone's trying to build the next metaverse. EA's already doing it. It's gonna be called The Sims. Imagine this. Imagine this, people. You don't just play your Sims. You are your Sims. You enter a home that you built using microtransactions and things. And then you go downtown. You visit your friend's house who also built a house using microtransactions. The world is real. And if you want to woohoo that person, you got to ask them, Hey, can I woohoo you? This is Sims 5, a new reality. B R B R. Okay. <laughs> oh, NFT unique. That's a good idea. Yeah, yeah. We are. We are Sims 5. <laughs> Imagine, imagine. It's like, oh, I want to use this window. How much does this window cost? Ten dollars for that window? Oh, okay, okay. Like real monies? Like real monies? Oh, okay. <laughs> Doom us all. I don't know that uh, song is from it was the VR one. Uh, it's from VR Troopers. Basically, it was like a ripoff of um, of Power Rangers. It was basically a, a Power Ranger ripoff. That's what it was. If you're wondering, what are we just listening to? Um, I think we did a great job today. I think we've done a really good job today. This didn't really, really dark in this game. Yes. You know, all these like metaverse though, this metaverse stuff. Um, like everyone wants to build the metaverse, right? Facebook's trying to build the metaverse. No one's going to use Facebook metaverse. You know why? Because it's not fun. I tell the if the metaverse ever comes and is ever a thing, if it is ever a thing, it will come from a video game. It will be a video game. It'll be it's something that people play and it'll be a lot of fun and people like it. And then that's the metaverse. That, become, that will become the metaverse. They add more to it. Fortnite could be the metaverse early stages of it. You know, a lot of people play it. But Second Life, oh no. I don't know if there still is, but I thought there was like a ban. We couldn't actually stream Second Life on Twitch for good reason. Second Life for the win. Is Metaverse just VR chats? Um, it doesn't have to technically be VR, but it is like, you know, a, a platform where you hang out with people, friends, new people. You can play all kinds of games. You could shop for stuff for your avatar, for your homes. 
Roblox. I mean, yeah, I think Roblox could be a metaverse if it like looked better. <laughs> and it was accepted by more than you know younger audiences. Uh VR chairs kind of metaverse. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I mean all you yeah, I mean, yeah. But I mean all you do is chat in that. Like a meta uh, a metaverse is going like it's like the entire internet, but in a virtual form. That's what I s assume the metaverse is. I don't think Mark Zuckerberg is going to be able to build it. I, don't, I think they are coming at it as a business point of view. And nobody wants... you got to really go in and be like, yeah, you know what? I want to go to Mark Zuckerberg's metaverse. You know, the one with all the microtransactions or the things that have ads and... That isn't fun. You're gonna wanna go to one that has a bunch of games in it. You know? Like if there's like a game that you could play where it was like multiple games, you could do all kinds of things. This is a this is a, this is it, right? Like a game where it's got like a Sims thing going over here, it's got like a Fortnite thing over here, it's got a racing game over here, it's got a Grand Theft Auto thing going over here, it's got all kinds of different things. And they're really good games. Like VR checks. I say really good games because I know there's like like uh, Second Life or whatever has like games in it, but they're like lame. Like VR chat. Yeah, like VR chat. I mean, VR chat is kind of a, yeah, it's kind of like the early metaverse idea. But I just see that's a lot of chatting, like just chatting. It would look like Wreck It Ralph. Yes, it look like Wreck It Ralph. Um, Jules Woohoo. Welcome to the fans, Captain. It's your birthday. Happy birthday to you. Basically the world from Ready Player One. Yeah, that is that is that is it. That is it. That's what everyone's very excited. That's why all these companies are like, that's gonna be the future right there. That's not just a science fiction. That's a that is gonna happen. And all these companies wanna get in and they wanna be the one who builds it, because you know whoever builds that is gonna be very rich. Because if you are if if you own a, if you own the platform, then you're gonna be very rich. But it's not gonna work if nobody goes in there. That's the thing, and I don't think Facebook is gonna make that platform. That's gonna wanna. They've already got a thing kind of going now with the um they call it Horizon or whatever. Like if no one want, if no one's gonna use it, then it's gonna no one's it's gonna go nowhere. I remember once at E3, you don't remember which one, they showed a game where you could do anything, a superhero, a pirate, a mage, whatever, and then that was a, uh, and then another came out already. Yeah, Ready Player One, yeah. I haven't read, my wife read the book, I didn't read the book. Um... This room is a this this is a room. This is a room. We made a room today. Uh Sounds like my nightmare. <laughs> yeah, who knows? Who knows if it actually becomes a thing or not? And that's one of those things that people believe it could be. But it you know, it it might not ever be a thing. I am more confident that in the future everyone will be in a in a um a self-driving car driving everywhere than than the metaverse being a thing. Because the metaverse the catch on needs to have support of people willing to use it. And if it doesn't, then it's never a thing. A whole room? I know. We, we did a lot today. We did so much today. Wireless charging cars. There's a ride at Disney World called um, um, Revenge of the Resistance or something like that. Does anyone know what I'm talking about? Something like Resistance, um, Rise of Resistance. It's called Rise of Resistance, and uh, it is a ride where you are you essentially the car, 
the car that you go in, there's no track. You know how like on a, in like normal rides, you want like a little track, right? There are no track. This is basically a giant Roomba that you're on. It is it is a drone, and it it goes along a preset path. Like it knows where to go, but it is a self-contained um, ro you know dr <coughs> drone. And then the when you go to get off the ride, it actually pulls into a little spotter. And underneath it, that's where it's charging. There's a wireless charging pad underneath it. So when as you're loading and offloading, it's actually sitting there charging before it goes out again. That's why I could make that was that is one of the best rides. It's so amazing what they did. It's amazing. If you have a chance to go on that ride, do it. Cause it's like futuristic ride. Mickey Minnie's Runaway. Um, oh, really? I haven't been on that one. A giant Roomba. Yeah, it is. Oh, I is that like is that new? A Disneyland? When we went to Disneyland in April, they a uh, Toontown was all closed up. Oh yeah. Wait, the kids' room is based off of anything. I'm sorry, I'm gonna, uh, we're kind of like loosely basing it off like Boo's room from Monsters Inc. I guess it's a bit dark in there, though, isn't it? There's a wait. There's a Ratatouille ride. Really? You know what we could do. Put a window back there. I don't know which one to use, but we could put a window back there. Hey, Lama boys. Is it a Disney World ride? Uh, what self-driving cars if everyone drove a safe car, driving car there would be no accidents because then all the cars would communicate with each other and they would just kind of like They would just go on they basically would know where everyone else all the other cars are um, Hey, thank you so much for being here captain. How you doing? Maybe do like um A window here with some nice curtains or something It's a World Shake Showcase in Epcot. Oh. It's very late where you are. It's 11 o'clock. I would say that's very late. Not a few hours from now when I'm still streaming. Then you can say it's very late. For pedestrians, yeah, but I mean, like, unless you're like walking in front of it, you know. I mean, there's already pedestrian accidents already. You know, everyone got like freaked out when there was like a few pedestrian accidents, but like, that's already happening though. All the pedestrian accidents that are happening with real people in the car. Don't forget the fake room walls for the front um, of the real room. Don't forget the fake room walls in the front. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Like this. I don't know. we got a lot of work to do on this thing. I'm just kind of chilling right now. <laughs> We're talking about self-driving cars. I live in oh oh yeah 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 I know you do I mean I, I know you do yeah that's what I am. There are a ton of pedestrian accidents that don't happen because real people recognize other people, which self-driving cars are not totally bad at. I don't know about that. I feel like there's been a few, um, but if you ever like watch the footage of those, 
Like there was there was that one, I think it was the Uber one. And everyone was freaked out about it. But if you actually watched the footage like, from the car, like it literally there was a person there was like nothing and then there was a person. Like that person stepped right in front of the car. Like if you were if an actual driver would would also hit that person. You know? Um so I live in Iowa. As soon as they can bring us a car that can drive itself, I'm really happy to take it because I it's boring to drive in the state. It's boring. And nothing for hours. I need a monster party, a pet rat, a robot, a car, a toddler. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, but right now, I mean, like, five years from now, you know? He, uh, Elon wants to remove, wants to get uh, removed because it's hitting uh, toddler dummies. Oh my gosh. Iowa seats are pretty safe. True. <laughs> no one walks around in Iowa. Just drive everywhere. You know, technology is getting better, though. We cannot judge technology from yesterday, 10 years from now. Everything's going so, you know, you know what I mean? Things are getting always better, technology-wise. Um, I would like flying jets as well. That would never happen. That won't happen. That would never happen. Even if they were self-flying. Because if a car breaks down and it's self-driving, it's going to stop. If a flying car stops working, you crash into the ground. You run out of batteries. You want jetpacks? In like the 50s when they actually thought there was going to be a thing. Everyone jetpacking around. <laughs> That's what they actually thought. They thought that people were going to have jetpacks everywhere they went. Just like jetpack from their home to work. I'm about self-driving car for sure. Yeah. There's going to be a transition for him. Um, uh, I'm done being boring. <laughs> what like, okay, so that's one, right? But what like, what like future technology or thing are you actually like looking forward to? You know? I legitimate like what you think will actually happen you know teleportation probably not gonna happen in the near future like nearish future you think is gonna like be a thing anyone excited to put chips in their heads you excited about that Adam? <laughs> okay you don't like self-driving cars can I sell you on the chip inside in, in your house in your head I mean can I say you on that one you get Google immediately Time travel, please. <laughs> if I had time travel, here's what I would do. I would go back in time precisely one day before every popular meme has ever come out and replicated. That's what I would do. That's what I would do. I would be so popular on the internet, you know? I'll be happy if the US caught up with infrastructure tech. I mean, absolutely. Yes, that is 100% true. I would be, yeah. High speed trains absolutely needs to happen. Because you couldn't ignore cell phone and texts. Texts, you can't. <laughs> Hang on. Oh, I got a phone call. <laughs> Holograms, yeah. I want to see them finally. That'd be great, Em. I'm down with the brain chip and watching movies inside my head. Speaking of VR, VR is going to get to the point where it's so it'll be like it'll be like glasses and then even contact lenses. This is true. This is the, the VR is going rapidly moving ahead and they've even got they even have the glasses portion done already. 
but it's so expensive, you know. But you know, everything starts off super expensive before it gets down to like actually like affordable. But you'd be wearing these glasses or contact lenses, and that'll be VR, and you'll see like you could put you know a virtual TV on your wall, you put virtual paintings and stuff on your wall, you know. That's gonna be a thing. High speed transit, yeah, right. Yes, clean energy. That's that's honestly what we gotta work on. A hundred percent. You should uh, do a uh, stream VR. It's very awkward. It's very awkward though. True story. There's a guy who puts microchips in here. There's a guy who puts microchips in his head to open his house and Tesla. My dad and I were watching it on the news. He said he's going to end up getting his hands chopped off by some rubber so he can unlock. Oh. He put his hands on his head. His hands. Why he do that? Yeah, with solar power, that's true. Yes, for sure. Yeah, for, <laughs> I have mean heads. Could you imagine head? Let me open the door real fast. Boop, whoop. <laughs> this has been general gist of technology development by Dr. Glowon. Yeah, we got the gist of it. <laughs> I'm always very excited to hear about technology stuff when it's used for good. Um, hey, Angry Kitten, thank you so much for the four months. I'm very excited. I, I like technology, you know? Obviously, here I am on a computer. Um, all right. Uh, we didn't finish this house, did we? Did we, did we even do much? We got a kitchen done. Ish. That kitchen looks great, by the way. I think we nailed it. An Iron Man suit. You about the Iron Man game, Capone? I just imagine having a computer with uh, hang on, let me see that. Uh, a computer within my brain, and there's like a hundred thousand tabs open, so I can't figure out which one. <laughs> like, where's that music coming from? <laughs> we nailed it. I'll be right back. One second, peeps. One second. back hi everybody um i actually think uh the biggest thing in technology you're gonna develop is battery life that's gonna be another thing uh battery life we're gonna, there's someone's gonna cut the battery that lasts for like you know years a battery lasts for years i actually heard this and i don't know if this is true so don't quote me on this this could be this could be completely wrong, completely made up. So don't, don't be like, I heard this with Dr. Glow on, it must be real. I could be making this up, I don't know. I heard, on, I heard it on the internet, so you know. <laughs> but it's a battery that actually uses toxic waste and, and uh, like 
and can be powered for um for years and uh and and and, and because it uses toxic waste actually it's good for the environment because it's actually taking that waste it's just sitting there you know in whatever you know they have all these waste sitting there they can use these batteries i heard that I don't know if that's true or not. I could be making that up. I don't know. Uh, I, I saw it on the internet. <laughs> and poop. Yes. Um, Sims 5 isn't going to happen. I don't know how I feel about having toxic waste in my phone, in my pocket. But, like, you know, I'm sure they'll figure out the uh, logistical side of it all. <laughs> Maybe it's fine. I don't know. I don't know. But the idea is that that your phone will last it will never have to be charged and it will be it will basically you'll you'll have moved on to a new phone by the time that battery runs out you know yeah i think so i think so i have a battery in my head that uh lasts up to 10 years yeah Toxic waste and bioengineering bacteria. Yeah, 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 yeah. How does it self charge? You know, I'm not a scientist, so I can't even begin to tell you how I don't know how it works. <laughs> you know, magic. Like that. Ions. You know? Gluons. Do solar, uh... Sorry about that, Sid. Sorry about that. It could solve some energy problems right now. Yeah, that's true. But like I said, I think battery is going to be a thing that... You know, the, the batteries we use on our phones are actually pretty new, technology-wise. Um, because before that, we just use the, um, you know, the old regular batteries, but now... We have these batteries, but there's a downside to the batteries we use in our phones right now, in, in that they can explode, um, and they don't, and they they don't, they, their charges don't keep for very long. Uh, Sprinkles, thank you so much for the 23 months. Thank you so much for that. Uh, after long, long charges, you know, they eventually lose their charge over time. That's why whenever you get a new phone, it feels like the battery lasts forever. It's not like it's new technology. It's just because that's a new battery. Slowly, your phone will lose battery over time. Um, I just need to advance technology for laundry. Yeah? <laughs> yeah, like a self-folding... Ro a self-clothes folding robot. That would be sweet. It's just a, it's a giant robot... Uh, and all it does is fold laundry. That'd be great. All right, we're gonna switch up the game. Um, they could also explode. Um, sound of music. I seen parts of it a long time ago. Oh, I want to play that HP. Yes, I will play that. Yes, we will play that. Uh, we're gonna switch up the games now. We're gonna get the gist of a game. Is that just for Switch though? Is that just a Switch game? The robot needs to put the laundry away too. That's what our children are for. That's what the kids are for. Okay, this game is called Foundry. And it looks like Minecraft with Satisfactory built into it. I don't know, could be cool. Could be cool. They sent me a code, so we should check it out. Could be cool. We're gonna bumble in we're gonna bumble around. We're gonna bumble in here. Um, 
Let's check it out. I'll be streaming tomorrow some Dream Light Valley, just so you know. Um, early, earlier, like a daytime stream. Boundary. Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's get the gist of Boundary. HBO. Here we go. Mm. Thanks for having, hanging with me, everybody. Thanks for hanging with me. Did that take, Lily? Did that take? The kids, or oh, if they did that in my house, the wife would, would get very mad. Uh, with the glooby... Oh, really? Has he done it before? And now it's just not working? Oh, thank you. Right. Oh, you should have done. Harvester uh, Ella will be also be available on Steam, I think. Uh, and I'm really excited about it. Yeah, we're going to play it. It's like, um... It's like Stardew Valley meets um, Final Fantasy. So you might be excited for that uh, glam. Hold on. Yeah. Good. Let's do it. Let's do it. Okay, will this capture okay? Let's see if this works. We're gonna play a new game that uh, I don't know if it's out yet. This one's working. Mm -hmm. For some reason, Sims didn't want to work today. Uh, it just, it, I don't think it's out yet. It's coming out soon. And it's called Foundry, and we can make a little, um, we can make factories or something with it. Let me make sure I am actually able to stream this today. Um, I think there's that I could. Mm -hmm. Cool. Sweet. Sweet. It's got multiplayer as well. This game? This game? You know, real early access then. I think, I think there's gonna be a, um, I think there's gonna be a, um, an early access for it. Oh, sorry about that, Sid. I'm sorry. New eco. I don't know if this is gonna be eco. It's gonna be like, um, have you ever played, um, Satisfactory? Or Factorio? I think it's gonna be like that. Let's uh let's say how to YouTube. Let's say how to YouTube. Let's turn that down a bit so I can do my thing. Uh can we go over here without that crashing? Alright, here we go. Are you ready? Are you ready? <clears throat> here we go. I'm gonna stand up, let's sit down, and then we're gonna say hi to YouTube. Here we go. Are you ready? Here we go. Welcome to the gist of it. This is a channel where we play enough of the game to get the general gist of it. <laughs> so close. Welcome to the gist of it. This is a channel where we play enough of the game to get the general gist of it. So let's get the gist of Foundry. So let's get the gist of Foundry. All right, that's pretty good. We got the idea. We got the idea of this one. <laughs> mm. 
Okay, that's good. So I'm having a little drink of tea. Okay. Here we go. First try. Let's check this out. Just of it. Hopefully there's some kind of tutorial. Um, Poxted. <laughs> Ooh. It's gonna be cool. I like these kind of games. Alright, here we are. I'm uh, I'm a robot in a Minecrafty style world, it looks like. With all the blocks everywhere. They want me to mine 150 uh, thingies. Okay. Uh, how do I... Uh... Oh, here we go. Yeah, I got my drill. Is that what they want? That's just stone. Oh, okay. Well, basically, this is basically Minecraft. Leader. This is the, this is the closest you're gonna get to Minecraft. Um, press F two for information. This is like Raft two. It looks like Raft. Yeah, it looks like it looks like Crusader Kings. It looks like every game you've ever wanted me to play. <laughs> um, 150, uh, could you start, could you, could you give me a, could you give me a task that wasn't like a lot? Uh, what, 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 what is that? What's this thing? That's a stone. I got stone now. Okay. What do I find that thing? What do I, what do I, um, that, uh, okay. It's orange. It looks like, oh, it looks like this one. That's what we're looking for. These ones. Okay. Let's look for that. Oh, you know what? They're right here. Perfect. Dude. Oh. Oh. Okay. Well, we, we got, we're getting a lot. That was 45 of them. I'm just got a bunch of this. Crack all these eggs open. What's the worst that could happen? The game is a free demo, yes. Okay, we did it. We did it. We got those ones. What's this one look like? Alright, what does the other one look like? Oh, the other one's over here, I think. Uh, is, that, is that those blue things right there? Is that what that is? Let's have a look. That's not. That's biomass. Oh. Hmm. This also has multiplayer as well. This is a multiplayer game. I don't know the actual release date of the of the game. But you know, like I said, if you've ever played like uh, uh, Satisfactory, you're gonna recognize this kind of game. You know how you feel about it, yeah? Is it, uh, the other way it animates? Oh, look at this. Look at the world. Biomass is code for poop. Wait a minute. Is that it right there? Is that what we're looking for? Maybe. Yeah. I think that's it. The blue ones. That's it. We had 150 of these. Yay! All right. Oh, now one's biomass. Okay, where, where was all that biomass from earlier? It's a bunch of trees down there. Why, why did, I, <laughs> I don't know, that's a good question. Can we do third person? Um, again, this is probably like pretty early on. Uh, I don't know. Oh, hang on. First person look sensitivity. I don't know if there's a third person. It looks like vomit. <laughs> Can we dig the sand? Let's find out. 
Yeah, let's go towards those trees over there. Hopefully, we don't get whipped by these whipping whipping plants. They seem okay for now. It's kind of weird the way it crumbles. It's just kind of it's just kind of an animation choice, you know. Instead of like Minecraft where they just disappear. You know, they just kind of crumble away. And it's just an animation. Maybe look if there are keybinds, maybe. Oh yeah, maybe. Good point. I don't know if it'd be good to play in third person or not. Some people kind of like said they don't like the first person view. Uh, let's see. Do you see anything? Camera tools? Build. I don't. I don't see anything. Little camera tools, but that doesn't seem like it. Yeah, yeah. No, I understand. I, I understand. Well, let's try it. Alt U. Oh boy. This is a verb at all, and it's not represented in the game. Um, we're gonna, we're gonna close that. We're gonna close that one. <laughs> we're gonna close that one. Um, sometimes if you get motion sickness with these kind of games, like um, making the the field of view maybe <coughs> better. I know that sometimes that helps. I don't know if we can do that here. Yeah. I don't know. What's what's a good Oh, head bobbing. Yes. Do you Yeah, that's a good Yeah, yeah, that's a good question. That's a good one. I don't know if that's a thing we can turn off. I mean, again, this game is pretty early on, so um that might be something they add later if they... Oh, head bobbing. Here we go. We have to turn that off. There we go. There we go. Yeah, let me know if that feels better for you. All right, here we go. Get some of this biomass. Oh. It's like big old watermelons. It's gonna crack it open with my, my giant drill. Yay! Okay. Now, we gotta craft a furnace. Why should we do that? That's better. Okay, good. Um, let's do it on top of this mountain. Because that's where those rocks were. By the way, the next MCC is going to happen inside this game. You watch. MCC. It'll be FCC. <laughs> Up here. Yeah. You know what? Actually, over here. This is perfect. Just down here. We'll, we'll start a little base down here. Okay. Uh, how do we uh, how, 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 how do we do that? Uh, press B. Okay. That, that did not help me. What else? Uh, D four B. Uh, oh, press C. Okay. Let's see what we got here. Structures. We want the thing. Hey, that's right here. Build one of those. Did I do it? I did it. Yay! Alright. Um. We shall put this, I don't know, right here. Alright! Nice. Okay. 
Um, how do I get Chrome on this computer? Um, I want to watch some YouTube or something. Sweet. Testing, I see it. I see it, Catherine. I see you. I see you, Catherine. Uh, so now, now what do I do? <laughs> so it's being very really weird. Oh, really? Okay, so this is like a furnace, so let's uh let's you know cook up some of that stuff we uh we got earlier. Missing fuel. Uh do you want some put some put some biofuel in there? Put the biofuel in there. There we go. Yeah. Alright. Uh uh do it. Do the thing. Cook it. Press it. Push it. Is it working? Is it doing it? Are you, uh... Hello? Hello? Dong, 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 dong! You working? A Minecraft and No Man's Sky? A No Man, uh... Yeah, maybe. Reset task. No, I, I want to do that. Fuel. Output. Fuel. Let's see what the thing says to do. <laughs> right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, okay, here we go. Go to the front screen. Press configure. Select the item you want to create from. Select the required item items. And then the auto insert button, which will add as much items as possible to the machine by pressing the manage inventory and dragging the items. Uh, oh, oh, okay. Okay. Oh, actually, I need to put this in here. Right, there it goes. Now it's working. Yeah! Sweet. You did it. I'm learning. <laughs> You're being mean, why? <laughs> I'm all good. I really like these kind of games. I don't know if we like this one, but we'll see. You know, start figuring out how to work it, you know? Is that doing the thing? So we're getting, we're putting this in and we're cooking and we're getting this one here. Right, we gotta get 40 of those. All right, well, we'll just kind of let that go then. Now, can I watch can I watch YouTube on here while I wait? Yeah. Sweet. I'm gonna overlay YouTube on top of it, Lily. It's gonna be so funny. Everyone on YouTube's gonna love it, you know? <laughs> Carl, have a nice night. Thanks for being here. <laughs> the train game. This, this is not the train game. This is not the train game. <laughs> Give this one a chance. This is not the train game. <laughs> the train game was like Nintendo asking me to play that game. I was like, okay, well, I mean, can you climb the trees? I don't know if you can. I don't know. All right, do we get it now? We got the thing? Yes, I did. Okay, great. Now, do another thing. Reset task. Do this one. Make that one. Put those in there like that. Sweet, okay. Now it's making the other things. What I need those for, I don't know. But the thing tells me to make them, so I'm making them. Uh, can you get killed by trees? I mean, I don't, I don't know, I mean. Um, when I look around, it kind of like, what is that called? Kind of a bit goofy, doesn't it? 
Let me see that. All right, we did it. I did the thing. Uh, now I gotta craft 20 building blocks. Place 20 building blocks as foundation next to the ore deposits. Okay, all right. Is that is that this thing? Is that in this? Do I do that in this thing? <coughs> Let's find out. Oh no no, we just craft them. Oh okay, hang on. Oh, it's this right here. All right, so. Um, building blocks. And you want 20 of those. Yay. I got them now. You have screen tearing. That's what it's called. How do I fix that? How do we fix that? What, would, what setting would I put in to fix that? What is that? Turn off or on something? V-Sync maybe? Turn on the V-Sync? Would that cause it to not do that anymore? Kind of distracting, honestly. Okay, cool. We're crafting. Yeah. Uh oh, it's getting late. Hopefully zombies don't come out and get me. Oh, there's a flashlight. Here we go. Um. Oh, right down here. Yeah. Neat. Turn, well, no, it was on before. I turned it on. No, it was off before. I turned it on. Wait, I just realized what this game reminds me of. What does it remind you of? What? Wizards? What are what? Oh, like the graphics? Is that what you're saying? Oh my gosh, getting really late in here. Can this, uh, can the flashlight be any brighter? Because it's, you know, it's, it's, it's not that bright, honestly. It's not that bright. Can I sleep? Can I make a bed? Um, building blocks. Uh, so we what, what I gotta build these blocks at next to an ore deposit. Oh, that's where we got the ore originally. I don't know where, I don't know where those were now. Oh, it's up here. Okay. Yeah, like right here. Sure. We'll put the ore right here. I think we're doing great. Make a bed. <laughs> I, don't know. I don't know if we can make a bed. I don't know where the bed is. <laughs> Do you see a bed in here? <laughs> Why is there a night? Why is there a day night cycle? Turn it off, dog. The V sync that is. What didn't it? But did not. It wasn't it. Wasn't it on or off causing problems? Hang on, can I turn off the day? Oh, hit apply. Oh, did I not do it? Anything? Well, it's off now. That's what we want, yeah? Okay. We're going to build, uh, I guess, uh, when it says next to it, like how close you're talking about, like right here? Like right here? Oh. Yay, I did it. Sweet. Um, I built this platform. Pretty sweet, eh? Now, craft a drone miner. Um, do they have to be young? Read Tree's message. There was a Windows 11 update yesterday that was causing screen tearing and FPS drops. Oh, that's probably what I got, Train. Well, that's great. Is there any way, like, not to have that? You didn't change. What do you mean I didn't change the V-Singer? What do you mean? It's now off. Should I have it on or off? It was off. I turned it on. And you told me to turn it off. So I turned it off. But uh, you keep it off. It was off originally, by the way. It was originally off. But to be fair, who would update Windows? I did update Windows. You should install the Windows 10, dog. I'm not going to install Windows 10. <laughs> Well, if, I, if I do that, then it'll be constantly bugging me. Update to the eleven. Uh, this is a this is a game. Um, like uh, it's like um, satisfactory. I think <laughs> Windows XP. I should just go down to Windows ninety eight. Uh, 
That's good, Sid. Live by, live by my example. <laughs> oh, boy. What's the point of nighttime? What is the point of it? You know? Is there like monsters out at nighttime? Wait, hang on a second. Um, day night on. Um, can I make it daytime? I just like to be able to see what I'm doing, you know? I have this like thing, and, and I know it's kind of crazy, but I have this thing in video games where I like to see what I'm doing. Um, I don't know. I must be alone in this. <laughs> All right, how do we craft? All right, let's craft a drone miner. What does that look like? Uh, research lab. Mm -hmm. Drone miner right here. Oh, I need more thingies. I need I need uh, machine parts, electric components. Oh, well, how do I get all that stuff? Electric components. All right, craft some of those. I need like uh, six of those, and I only have one. How do I get more of those? I need wires. How do I get wires? I need that. How do I get those? I gotta, I gotta get more stuff. We have to get more stuff. Basically, we need to craft a bunch. We're gonna get all these rocks here. Uh, I did play Alpha Minecraft. Uh, <laughs> Why do they look like that inside? Lily? I don't know. I don't know, Lily. I'm going to do the opposite. I'm always going to upgrade them. Um, because I'm cool. I'm a cool guy. All right, got a bunch of those. Can I move my uh, my furnace machine? That is somewhere around here. I forget where because it's the middle of the night. I can't see nothing. Hello. Uh, hello. Furnace. Oh boy. <laughs> Can this? I don't know. Can this light be any brighter? Cause I don't know. I can't see nothing. In I can't see nothing. All right, where's the where's the base gone? All right, back to the base. I thought the footage was down here. Oh, sorry, it's right there. I see him. <laughs> I don't mean to be rude. Are you being rude, Lily? How do we pick this up? Can we pick this up? Can I move this thing? Can I uh, dismantle this thing? Destroy item. Drag item in here to destroy it. No, I guess that's um. Chronicle, have a good night. I can see that this game is definitely um winning you all over. You, I, mean, I can, I can tell you all loving this game. I can tell. Don't lie to me. You're all loving it. I am also loving it. Oh, I can't move it. So let me just uh, let me just reset this thing. And then I'm going to make a bunch of these. We're going to make a bunch of those. We're going to keep that going. Okay. You just do that. I'm going to make another one of these. And I'm also going to uh, get some more biofuel. It's just a weird texture. <laughs> yeah, it's just, I just have a weird texture back in Minecraft. <laughs> just imagine I'm playing Minecraft and it's just kind of a weird texture back, okay? Uh, 
Uh, I think, I think, you, you don't, you, I think right now we're early on and you're going to see like, this is all about automation. Right now we're doing it all ourselves because we don't have these stuff built up. But once we get automation going, it, you know, you let these little conveyor belts, it's all going to be on the little conveyor belts, it's going to the machines. It's all about automation. And I think it's kind of fun when you get the little conveyor belts going. Right, I got some more biofuel. Let's go back to the main base, which again, I can't quite see where it's at. Um, oh, it's right here. Great. Sweet. We're going to build another one of these things. The fuel. At least it gives me tasks, which is good, because otherwise I'd be like, I don't know what I'm doing, though. I don't. How do I close that one? Wait, what? What? Current tasks? Could you, could you go, could you, could you go away? What is this thing? What is this thing? What is this pop up? I press the button. Oh, there it goes. Okay, it's a V. Um, will this enable hoarding? Yes! To the highest degree. The best kind of hoarding, though. Hmm. This is satisfactory. This is this is basically Minecraft means satisfactory. This is what it is. Yes. All right, got another one of these things. Now this one is gonna make these ones. And I'll put all that biofuel in there, and also this in there. Great. There it goes. When is it gonna be day? Really? The game heard all your mean comments and it said, all right, you don't like the way he looks? Fine. Nighttime forever. That's what the game said. You heard his feelings. Really? You heard his feelings. <laughs> the game has hidden itself. <laughs> I did see a toggle for day-night cycle. Um, I'm going to turn it off once it's daytime. I think maybe that's what we do. Obviously, if I turn it off now, it'll probably just stay nighttime. Um, well, I can't. What's over here? All right, how are you doing? Did you get all the things done yet? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Put more of it in there. Actually, you know what? Let me take all this stuff out. There's gotta be a way to repack this thing. Shut down. You know, close it up. Get rid of it kind of thing. I don't know. F maybe? Oh, here we go. Oh, here we go. There we go, get rid of it. Cause we're up here now. Oh, and it's daytime now, suede. The sun's out. I can see things now. Yay. All right, let's put this one right there. All right, so you're gonna be doing these. And you're gonna be doing those. We get the rods from here, and we get the plates from there. Okay. Any questions, Lily? Oh, look at the sun. It's beautiful. I will say, I kind of wish the game took place in more of um. I mean, obviously, it seems like an alien planet. I'm sure, that's what they're going for. I do kind of wish it was taking place in more of a, a grounded like. I don't know, like a real area, like grass and real trees, you know? I can see what they're going for, though. I can see, I, 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 I get it, you know? Um, okay, so, the drone. What do we need for this again? We need a bunch of stuff. We need a bunch of stuff. 
There it is right there. Oh, I can build it right now? Sweet. Okay, let's do it. I did it. I did it. Did I do it? Drone Miner. Yes, here it is. Nice. Put it right down here. Alright, so now build a drone miner on the foundation. Can do game. What do you want it? What uh what do you uh Build the drone miner on the foundation? It doesn't want to go on the foundation though. Maybe um But it doesn't want to go there. Can it be half on the foundation? Can it be like half on the foundation? You are one of my favorite YouTube channels. I look forward to your post. Oh, thank you. Night Magic, appreciate that. Uh, doesn't want to go there though. Am I goofy here? Am I goofy? <laughs> it only wants to be not on there. Uh, the drone miner can be found in the crafting frame. When crafting and place it on a foundation, you have to build it next to an ore. Oh, I gotta build it close to the ore. We're not close enough. This is close. This is not close. My foundation I built here, not close enough. Right, 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 because this is right here. Okay, so let's uh, pick up all this foundation and move it. We're moving slightly to the left. I'm learning, Lily. All right. We're going to put the foundation right here. Yeah, there we go. Nice. Okay, now I can build this thing. Right here. Sweet. Did it. Craft a biomass generator. All right. Everything we own in the box to the left. <laughs> How do we build a biomass generator? Biomass generator. I need electric comp uh, component. Okay, hang on. If I get all this stuff, I will take all this, take all that, take all that. I bet I can make it now. Yes. Need stuff. Need stuff to build with. See down here building. See this here. It's building it. It's making it for me. Perfect. Okay. Oops. All right. Um, any particular location you want it? On the foundation? A little bit right next to him. Right there. Nice. Okay. That's got its own screen as well. Stuff and things. It's kind of like very eerie music. You know, now it's kind of like light. Let's just go here. I'm going to turn that off. I don't know if that's actually going to stop the daytime from progressing. We'll see. We'll kind of keep it there. All right, now I'm going to craft a smelter, two loaders, and 20 conveyors, and one smelter on the foundation. Uh, oh, no, I'm going to build the smelter on the foundation. Got it, got it, got it. Okay, okay. I can do that. I'm, I'm good at games. Here we go. Well, uh, um... Two loaders, but I might need more stuff. Let me put more things in here. Uh, what was this one again? The blue one. Oh, wait, I'm gonna need more blue stuff for this one. 
I've got lots of the orange things. But I don't have a lot of the blue things. Um, where were the blue things at? Yeah, it's honest, it's very quiet. Don't you hate when you just try to do a project and you run out of blue stuff? I mean, it's annoying. Ah, blue stuff over here. Sweet. We're gonna all this blue stuff. Well, once I get into it, I think you'll, I think you'll see. Maybe you'll be like, oh, okay, I get it now. Or you'll be like, eh, still not for me. I've been playing a lot of Factorio lately, so I kind of, even though I don't know how to play this game, um, I understand the concepts it's going for him. Okay. Right, good. We've got all those blue stuff. Let's head back. To a sweet base. The blue drink. Now put those in there. Nice. Okay, good. And now I can make a smelter. No, I can't. Because I still need to get stuff. Still need to uh, get stuff here. <coughs> oh, it's all about hoarding. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, because see, these only take these only take a hundred. I can't, and and I would want to, you know, I don't want to keep my, you know. Um, loading these in. We'll have little conveyor belts. We'll have the mine, like an automatic miner and a conveyor belt going into these machines and then going and then taking this stuff out to go other places. So you start like automating. Right now we're doing everything by hand, but later on you just kind of build this automating machine to do it for you. And that's kind of the idea of this game. If all goes well, we'll play some more Monkey Island later on today, okay? Um, all goes well. I gotta get the conveyor belts. Alright, do I have enough? Do I have enough now? Right, can I build a smelter? Yes, I can. Smelter? Okay. And then 20 conveyor belts. See, I can only make 19 right now. Let me get a bit more stuff out of here. I still, I still, I still need more stuff. Mm. Yeah, I think we could do that. Huh? I don't think we're gonna be playing this all night. I feel like the chat isn't a hundred percent sold on this game. I'm getting this idea. Maybe I have a feeling. And what am I gonna put the snow to add? Oh, it's huge. Uh, you want it on the foundation? Okay, then I gotta make the foundation bigger. <laughs> it's okay, I don't care. <laughs> I'm gonna play it off stream. We'll love every moment of it. Make some more of these. Make this a big foundation. Oh, this one ran out of fuel. Oh, I'm gonna need more fuel. Let's go drill some more watermelons. Mm -hmm. Wait, can I drill the tree? Yes, I can. Yay. So sorry, tree. And I crumble them. <laughs> Get some more of this. I drill this plant. I can drill all the plants. I don't know why you would drill a plant, but 
we get biomass from it. That's good. Alright. I guarantee in one year, Lily's gonna message me and be like, I'm so hooked on this game. I'm like, I know, I know, I know, I know. I put the biomass in there. And some more of the blue stuff. Oh, wait, this one needs biomass. Can I split this or do I split this? How do I split? Uh, I'm not quite sure how to split a thing. I don't know. <laughs> if the art gets better, maybe. Yeah, that's what, that's that's kind of trippy. Um, <laughs> what is what is it? What is it? <laughs> what is like? What is like not clicking? Well, let's get some more biomass then. <laughs> the vomit, uh, the rock textures. <laughs> what if I start playing Minecraft again, but with this texture pack? Yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There it goes. Okay, good. It's giving you typos. Yes, the Minecraft, no to the texture. <laughs> okay, can I put the smelter right here? It's a little big game. It's a bit big. It's a bit huge. You want me to you want me to put that on there? Oh, okay. Let me make this platform even bigger. Did you, did you run out of stuff? Did you run out? Did you run out of things? You ran out of things. Oh, see, that's each biofuel. Once it goes down, it gets another one. And there's 58 left, and there's 68 in them. I'm loving this, peeps. This is the greatest. I'm loving every moment of this. All right. All right, now it's a big old platform. Smelter. Smelt over there. Is that a good place for it? Is that yeah, right there, the panel right there. Sweet, look at that thing. Nice. Now we need twenty conveyors. I can make six, but I get more stuff. I keep pressing tab. I feel like tab is should be the uh, this. Open the crafting tool. We're getting the gist of it. Uh, I, I like I like these kind of games, talk. I think people are tripping up on the art style. I don't think it's that bad, honestly. Um, but you know, everyone has their own opinions, and that's fine. 
and they won. So, just kidding. Um, yeah, this is a this is a multiplayer game. You can play as multiplayer. Uh, I've often asked James, like, "Hey, James, we should play some Satisfactory together," and he never responds. So I don't know. Um, I don't know if James likes these kind of games. All right, this was one out of orange stuff, but I can dig here. Even though we ran out of eggs, I can just kind of dig this stuff. And there's like a bunch of it right here. You know this kind of stuff? Yeah. It's Minecraft meets Satisfactory, exactly. And I put it, and then put those in there like that, and keep making more plates. Cause I need a bunch. It's kind of slow starting out because we're um, having to cook all this stuff, you know. Let's get some more blue stuff, because we're going to need it. Uh. James like Dinkum. <laughs> yeah. He's kind of off of Minecraft right now. What if Zeus would like this kind of game? Uh, yeah, you know. I think, um, I think him and me are kind of waiting for a big update that's exciting. You know, if there's a big update that's exciting, I'll definitely... I'm probably more, I'm probably more waiting to come back to it. Um, but he's, like, really waiting for a big update. You know? Well, you know, this is, um, take... Yeah, but this is more the voxel-based, so... It's more on a grid. Satisfactory is it? I mean, yeah, I mean, Satisfactory is also a great looking game. I have no idea what Minecraft is. You've been on Sims, yeah. Alright, let's get those. Hopefully, this is good. Right, should be good now. We should be good. Power lies or Sims 5? Which comes first? Which comes first? I'm not 100% sold on the art style of Power Lies, honestly. I've seen some of the later animations and I don't know. We'll see. Did I, did I do it? Did I not do it? Oh no, I made 22 conveyor slopes, not conveyors. <laughs> I'm saying, well, if we ever need to go up, we're going to be perfect. It's going to be great. Um, so I got to make 20 of those, not 20 of those. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Chat, why didn't you tell me? That's gonna be the blooper wheel. <laughs> what do the sandy stones give you when you mine them? They give you sand, or right here? Sand.
You know, I should have seen the zero or twenty and never going up when I was crafting a bunch. It says that twelve are have built to them. Right, let's make a bunch more of these then. I need more blue stuff. Sorry, chap. But I'm loving every moment of this. Manin, manin, manin. Lily, this is just like um, medieval, that medieval game that you played. Just like that. But with a drill. Medieval Dynasty. And I ate way too many of them, yeah? I just got married and then I switched over to No Man's Sky. At first I read that, I thought you said I just got married in No Man's Sky, and I was like, holy moly. I didn't know they added that to the game. They could have had me, like, I don't know, build a drill early on, so I'm not, like, doing this a bunch. They were relying on me digging myself um, a lot early on. When are we going to automate this drilling service? Don't mock me. You know what? I like Medieval Dynasty. I like it. I played it on my uh, Steam Deck. You know a couple that got mad and wow, like a fish in real life? Now we're cooking with gas. You got married in uh, Final Fantasy XIV? That's awesome. That's so cool. Hopefully this is enough. It's not enough. It is not enough. What oh, is? All right, cool. Finally made enough. Okay, build a research lab. Okay. How uh, much? How, how much? Uh, how much does that cost? Um. Is that fun? Right here. I need a bunch of things. Okay. Alright, y'all cooking? I guess I can make more of these thingies. Well, I just need more rocks, you know? They should... I, I, mean, I don't know why they didn't give me, like, an automatic miner. I mean, did they? Like, what does this thing do? Wait, what does this thing do? Power. I need power. Does it, doesn't this mine stuff? Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Am I, is this, is this supposed to mine, is that supposed to mine that? 
Is that what I'm supposed to do? Hang on a second. There's a biofuel on this thing. I think that's what I'm supposed to do. I mean, that's literally what that was for. And I'm just like mining myself. Silly glue on. <laughs> right, let's get some of this stuff. Chop this tree down, get some watermelons. Okay. Doo -doo. This music's very like Zen. Okay. Put the biofuel in here. Right. Right. Yeah, look at. Look. That's what I. Oh! I've been mining this myself! Now my little droids are doing it! Sweet! There they go, they go in the box there. Ah, oh, that's awesome! Hang on, can I use my conveyor belts to like, I don't know, go into that thing? Is that what that's supposed to do? I mean, is it like a, an, an insert in here? Is that what that does? Hmm. I'm not sure if that one works like that. Get rid of that. <laughs> Looks like Glow has got the gist of it. Maybe like this. No. Actually, hang on. It probably goes to this thing. That, that's probably what that thing's for. That's the smelter. Go in there. Maybe. Love is coming out, though. Is it too high? Um... Make those things. You need biofuel as well? Can you hook up to that thing? Yeah, maybe. Hang on, let's put this lower. I mean, why have me build it if they're not going to use it, you know? Like that? Is that how that goes? Hmm. Obviously, they come out the little doors, right? How does the stuff come out? The machine inventory is full. How do I put in that thing? Go in there. Do I need to use my slopes? What does my slopes look like? No. I don't think so. Do I have to tell it to go? Do I have to like, say go into that? Uh, go in there? Good status? Oh boy. Um. <sighs> Lily, how does this work? I don't know. Move the belt over one to like there. Okay. I mean, that's why we built this thing. Maybe the other machine needs biofuel first. Oh, maybe.
Kind of feel like it should just power from the power biofuel generator. Not liking that. Inputs. Oh wait, hang on. No in uh, out. This is automatically taking it. It takes that and makes that. That stays in there. Poor Lily. I zoned out. Sorry. Lily, please try to pay attention, okay? Not to go having a tough time as it is. Maybe underneath it? Maybe it goes like, maybe it comes out underneath it. Once we get this figured out, it's going to be pretty sweet. You know? Is it like pooping on top of it there? Is it like pooping down? Missing found it. Now it's complaining. Now it's upset. I don't know, game. Maybe you could tell me how this works. It's able to build, but you're not telling me how it works, though. Maybe this needs to be have a full foundation over it. Oh, it does. Okay. Is there a manual? I don't know. Let's see. Let's see. Um, it's going to be so obvious once we figure this out. That's how conveyor belts work. Right, but how does it come out of the machine, though? Is there like a drone one? Automation. Wait, 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 wait. Wait a minute. We made a loader. What's this thing do? Building belt. Oh, 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 we gotta put we gotta put on this thing. Ooh, that goes there. And then just a funsies. We put pin it. Like this. Right? Yes. And then you know, we can uh, do this. Comes out of there. Goes along there, and then turns, goes in there. Ah! Yay! There we go! Sweet! Now it's automatically making those things. I don't gotta use these things anymore. And my little robots are going to town? Sweet! We learnt! Right, so what I should do is, I should build like a thing here. And another smelter, and uh, and bring up the um the blue ones. Bring them over here, you know. Look at all my rocks going into that machine. This is pretty sweet. This is pretty sweet. It only took thirty minutes. <laughs> well, the game didn't tell me. It just told me what I had to do, but didn't tell me how to do it. <laughs> you can't understand. I'm under a lot of pressure right now. All right, so this this is just be a this is just be a little mining station, you know. When it all comes together, it's a beautiful thing. All right, put one of those there, my drone thingy. I also need another biomass generator. Right now, powering stuff is going to be difficult because I got to keep running and chopping those trees down. Look at this. Beautiful automation. All right, making up a biomass generator here. I need two more loaders. Okay. Eventually you get power and you can power stuff and make it easier. <laughs> Some just are harder than others, true. <laughs> Alright. There's a biomass generator there. And then I put a loader. Get a load of this. <laughs> That's a little load of humor for you. Pretty good. That's a pretty good job, Halloween. Hey, 
Let me get some more biomass. You have to laugh, Lily, but I appreciate the, uh, I appreciate that. Uh, it is new. I don't think it's actually come out yet. It's an early development. Too. So, it, I mean, I don't know if it will, but potentially it could look different when it's finally out. I don't know if that's... Wizard World. I've never played Wizard 101, but that's a very different game. Alright. A rock hoarding game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What you're collecting resources and then you're making that into other things to make more things and more things. Making machines. Okay, then put my stuff in here. And that's gonna go. And then we're gonna say uh we're gonna turn that on, right? Start, yeah. There they go. Little droid little uh, droids there doing their thingies. Perfect. Now this is gonna be a little tricky. We're gonna have to luckily I made a bunch of slopes. See somehow I knew. Wanna take this back to the base. The Jizzard Toon Town. Is that working? Is that uh, you all working? You putting stuff in there? I don't see anything coming out though, so... Maybe it won't come out until it has a, a place to put it. things maybe I can like oh wait that's it that's an output output no conveyor what does that mean is this the wrong is this the wrong thing What's, is this the is this the right uh, loader is there a loader and an offloader maybe this is the wrong one hang on get with that for a second intake Output, output, input, output, input. Well, that's right. That is, that is, uh, that is right. Oh, you know what? I think the, I think the belt is too low. I think I made it too low. Oh, I need more, dang it. Yeah. There we go. Perfect. So now we just gotta get it back to my main base, which is way over there. I'll build another smelter there too. This will be great. This is gonna be great. Look at all my rocks coming up. I'm never gonna have to run over there ever again. Unless that thing runs out of energy. Then I will have to run over there again. Get more energy in there. I think it automatically does it. Okay. This music is so zen. It's so zen. 
They're like tasty mushrooms. How's it going over here? How are you? Stop. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. How's this doing? I'll take all those out of them. Very good. Hey, thank you so much for the 18 months of support. Appreciate that. Uh, we're going to extend the foundation. Enough to build another one of those smelters. Convey about song coming. Yeah, pop that one right there. Apparently, it doesn't need... To, <laughs> it doesn't need a full foundation. You can kind of ha half hang off the side. Which is great. Now, let's get the... The blue stuff over to it. Zen. Oops. Zen. Zen. Oh, that's gone the wrong way. Oops. How do I, f how do I wrote flip it? Build mode snab. Um. How do I um? How do I flip it the way? Oh, there we go. Learning. You know what? Let's build from this side. Put that there. We're going to work backwards, you know. Now breathe in. Now breathe out. Breathe in. Breathe out. <sighs> Still awake over there, Chad? Still awake? Still awake with me? I think we're gonna go main with this game. This is gonna be our top game. So close, we're gonna bring these blue all the way back to the main base. I need more stuff. We would have to like mine ourselves now. It's automatically mining. That's good.
Oops. Or that one. All right, there we go. Now, all the walks, the blue walks, coming down the conveyor belt, gonna be going right into here. Oh, missing foundation. Oh, apparently it does need foundation. <laughs> so we do need to build that. That's fine, don't you worry about that. I got you sorted, there we go. I gave you just enough foundation. I'll give you a little bit more. Maybe we can do like some stilts so it doesn't look like it's um, floating. Okay, so this is gonna make those thingies automatically. There they go. Oh, yeah. This is great. In they go. Remember, we have to use those things? No more. Never again. We, gotta use, we don't have to use those ever again. Automation. That's the ticket. That's the ticket. Alright, I thought we got the gist of this. Um. Let's go. This is great, though. See, um. This is fun. Because it gets complicated. More things you gotta build, you know, until you gotta make these kind of wacky machines. The future is now. The future is here. Should we say this is it? Should we say this is it? Okay, we'll say this is it. We'll say this is it. It's a very zen music. Um, well, I think we got the gist of that one. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye. There we go. We did it. We did it. Who, who liked this game? Who liked this game? It's okay. You can speak up. I like it. Anyone here legitimately thought this was cool? Nobody? Okay. Um, <laughs> Me! Okay, good. Hey, sweet. <laughs> Crickets. <laughs> you play some Genshin? Sweet. <laughs> it's an interesting concept. So, so, um, uh, there, there are two other games that, um, are similar to this. Um, Factorio is a 2D version, looking down. I think that was the first time, the first, the first, uh, type of game like this. Then there's, um, Satisfactory, um, uh, which is a 3D first-person game. Uh, and then now there's this one, which is new. And this is kind of going with, um, the Minecraft style of uh, building much more block based not my cup of tea uh but it looks a little um true yeah that's fair enough that's fair enough satisfactory is great yeah okay so you like satisfactory um i'm watching wedding planner um while listening to the stream <laughs> Should we, uh, should we play more Monkey Island? Should we see if we can get another, you said about another hour to the left of that, uh, of that one. Should we play that? Look, it's already stopped. Maybe because, um, it's full up or no power. So right now with this, what, what we're in right now is that I have to keep filling it up with power. Because, um, but you know, later on you'll get like, you'll have, um, you'll get probably like ways to get better power, you know? Um, and then you get like logistics, so you can like uh, s split off conveyor belts, and I'm sure I don't know for sure. Oh, research, yeah. Once you get a research lab, probably have to research like better power stuff. Anyway, I'm gonna save this. Um, I'm gonna see how it runs on the Steam Deck. Probably play offline. Um, you went out of focus. Oh, oh, did I really? Oh my gosh! Thank you for letting me know. 
Then let's do it again. Let's do it again. One second. Well, I think we got the gist of that one. Thanks for watching. Bye bye. Was that better? <laughs> Was that better? Thanks for letting me know. Appreciate that. Okay. Nope, do it again. Keep doing it. Uh, okay, exit. Exit out of here. Uh, Lily, you go to bed? Lily, could you, could you give me a sweet title for Monkey Island before you go? Um, just in case, you know, you were, like, interested, maybe. Um, I'll show you some screenshots of the game. Or we can watch the trailer, maybe. You know, um... Right, we did all that, you know? Improve. This actually looks a lot more rough than the one we were playing, so I think they've cleaned up some of the, uh... They got electricity wires and stuff. See, they got electricity going. Develop. Ooh. Machinery. Leave the lane. Look at that. Big old machines. Alright, you got the gist of it. Um, alright. Uh, if it's okay, I can do it, but I know it's, I do it. I'll do it. The, um, the title is the name of the game, so you know how creative I'm being right now. When the title of the stream is the exact name of the game, Okay, there we go. Thank you, Safwan. <laughs> all right, all right. I think this was the newest one. It's gotta be right. Yup, yup. Okay. That's, that's all right. I thought I caught before we left. All right, so what are we doing? Uh, we are... Uh, uh, Catherine, what are we doing? Catherine, you still here? Um, what are we doing? We're trying to get keys. We're trying to get the keys to something or whatever. So that's cool. Um, we got two keys. And I think I kind of left at the point where I was like, I don't really know how to get the next ones. Um... We got the museum. Oh, right, yes, thank you. That's probably a good idea to start, eh? Look at my list. Okay. All right, so acquire a uh, widely stolen key. Right, yes. Require the old Miss Smith's key. Okay. Require Bella Fish's key. Get to get the flag from the fishing uh, shop. Become a high ranking chum. We did that. Get the museum key uh, flag. Get the museum's real flag. Get the quarantine ship flag. Help Elaine get a better scurvy flower, a flyer. Um, find the secret of Monkey Island. <laughs> sure. Well, I mean, let's go back in here. He's got a. He's got the thing, you know, locked up here. It's locked. Can I talk to him, maybe? Any chance you'll have the real flag on display anytime soon? Oh, no. Too valuable. It definitely stays in the storeroom. Uh, oh, say, hey, thank you for, um, for waiting for the ad. Sorry about that. Uh, uh, I've uh, definitely found appreciation for this game from watching you play. Oh, nice. This is a great game. It is. If I keep stealing this one, do you think, like, 
he'll have to put out the real one. I don't need another fake flag. Hmm. True. Um. Then why did I do all that? Whoa! That's not supposed to be unlocked. I'd better fold this and put it in storage. Then I can figure out what's wrong with the lock. Gotta get these edges perfect. <laughs> yes. Okay, hang on. Then we can use the fake one. Is that the fake one? I prefer to keep as many of these flags as possible. Okay. I'm not sure what I'm waiting for now. I'll just leave the replica flag okay, in place. Okay, automatically does it. Okay, you good. You won't notice the real flag is missing. I was going to take that one of us. Sweet, that was actually super easy. <laughs> Stroll on out, dude. It was a priceless cultural artifact handed down through the generations. He smashed it to smithereens before I was even out of the building. To say nothing of the government, which is now in complete turmoil, he officially declared anarchy. <laughs> is it really anarchy if you officially declare it? <laughs> Apparently the answer is yes. I'm very sorry for your loss. Losses. Judge Plank said he had a wild look. Like, like something was trying to push its way out of his head through his eyes. Sane people don't look like that. The judge? Hmm. Okay, okay. Well, we need to get the flyer done so we can give it to the ship so they allow us on board and take the flag, or maybe just get the flag from that ship. Um, I know that much. Let me go back over here then and talk to the judge. Because we gotta get, uh... What's his name? 10 years of service. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's what I mean. That, that's what we gotta do. Of the, the pitch of us on the wall. Amazing. May I approach the bench, Your Honor? The Queen of Bermuda is always allowed to approach the bench. Your Honor, may I inquire about the case of everyone v. Stan? Sales and marketing people like Stan are a blight on society, to be sure. But a month was all I could give him. The case lacked Ooh. evidence. If, Sorry. if there had been any legally binding evidence, recording. I would have given him ten years with no chance for parole. Court is adjourned! Mm. Right. Oops, hang on. Don't, no, don't, no, don't. Okay. No, 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 no. We go. Go back in there. Uh... Okay, let me just... Maybe this is, like, simpler than I think it is. We got... Oh, hang on, let's pick inside. There is a lot of junk in here, but I think I see the evidence that will lock Stan up for a long, long time. Can I, like... Um... Put this in here? No? Your Honor, I resubmit this satchel bursting with incriminating financial documents as Exhibit A in Everyone v. Stan. Right. The evidence is so entered. Hmm. The court requires that Ned Filigree swear an affidavit if said evidence is to be accepted. Um, I can swear, uh, no, I, can you honor, please cite the statue acquiring a sworn out of, okay, we already did that one already. The court, no. I've tried all of these and nothing works. Uh, why is there a picture of Freepwood on the wall? Because I'm the queen of this area now. We're the queen of the area. And the new status as queen? Maybe, I mean... For the court, I can state that I'm Ned Filigree. This court can establish Same. these heavy customs documents that your name is actually Guybrush Threepwood Esquire. If I don't get order, I will clear the court. The court can only accept said documents when accompanied by a sworn affidavit of the person who is legally Ned Filigree. Court is adjourned. So I got legally changed my name somehow. Do I have like uh, something like that or 
Is there something I have that I can do that with? I have to be Ned, basically, because Ned's gone. It's the judicial order for Stan's imprisonment. It says he only has one month left. Yeah. I mean, we can go get Ned, but I don't know where Ned went. Ned, like, literally left. I don't know where he went. I mean, I haven't been everywhere since he left, so maybe we could look around for him. I'm not 100% sure how to do this. Yeah, what do we have? We have, well, the key, uh, fish. We have, um, uh, matches. We have, um, notes. Oh, yeah, it's from that cave thing. Stan's thing. The evidence against Stan. The sign. The, the uh, the demon pepper. The, uh, the limes. The screwy flower. Flyer. Uh, the chum's hook. The toothbrush. The toothbrush is Stan's. I don't know if that, like, is something we can use. Elaine's notes. Hi, I'm working due west of Driftwood okay, Beach old. and due south of the lake today. We have the picture here, which, you know, you know, I can do that, but I don't know what, what that proves. Like, you know, uh, we have, I think it's out of juice. The disguise potion, but I can't use anymore. The Chuck's diary, this map, right? Do you have anything? of Ned that's not his picture. Just this and his picture. That's all I got. Should we go back to the island and have a, a cheeky look? Paperwork is the answer like in real life. A whole statue in your inventory? I mean... Paperwork is the answer. Do I combine paperwork or something? Am I combining stuff? Do I have? Oh! I tried rubbish before, but I did the courtroom. Oh, hang on a second. Ah. Looks like Ned had a valid accounting license on 26 islands, including the District of Columbia. I'm no expert, but this stuff looks as shady as an oak tree in a cave. This should be enough evidence to lock Stan up for a very long time. So maybe if I show him that, then he like, this is me, I'm Ned, I got the license here. Perhaps that's what we need. Should I show him that then? Order, order in the court. The court has previously recognized Ned's depth of knowledge in accounting. Do not waste the court's time by submitting redundant evidence. Mm, but. <coughs> Your Honor, I submit these highly prejudicial and incriminating <coughs> financial documents as Exhibit A in Everyone v. Stan. The evidence is so entered. Hmm. So he says no. The court requires that Ned filigree swear an affidavit if said evidence is to be accepted. For the court, I can state that I'm Ned Filigree. This court can establish vis-a-vis- -vis If I don't get- The court can only accept said court is such- Okay, I'm combine it with something. The picture? Oh! Right. Maybe that's... Cause that's my name, a picture. This should clear up any issues about who I am. Do you hereby swear under oath and penalty of incarceration that you are Ned Filigree and the documents you are submitting are true and legal? Uh, define the word true. Damn straight. Damn straight. Order. Order in the court. There will be no more outburst of profanity in this courtroom. In light of this new evidence, I hereby sentence Stan to 10 years of hard labor in the ice quarry with no chance of parole. Please retain this legally binding documents for your records. That was way too. That was more difficult than it had to be. <laughs> I had to open the box. That was the thing. 
I had to open the box in my inventory. I thought the box was the thing. <laughs> All right, cool. Ten years. In light of new evidence, uh, Stan is continuing hard labor in boom. Right. So now, he, now with, with all that, with all that, he's gonna want to escape. Because before he didn't want to escape jail because he only had one month. He's like, I got one month. I'll just stay here for a month. We're not gonna mess around. But now he's got ten years of hard time. Now he's gonna want to escape. You know. All you had to do is what the game told you. Actually, I did rummage through it. Or at least I thought I did. Um, and it just said something. But I might have done it in the courtroom. So... I swear that... I, I, uh, I tried it. Here we go. Uh, I have some disturbing news about your sentence. Ten years? Oh no, I can do a month standing on my head, but not ten years. You gotta get me out of here. Consider it done. Um. Hey, Stan. You gotta get me out of here, son. I can't do ten years. Do I have to use something on those shackles? The knife, maybe? That never ends well for the knife. Hmm. Well, we have uh, a key. This key doesn't fit. Maybe I can look at the key. Maybe we can get a key. Maybe we can uh, look at the lock. I can read the serial number. I'll copy it down. Sweet. Okay. That locksmith is definitely helping us out a lot in this game. Are we even paying them? I don't know, but we've been using them a bunch in this game. He won't fix it till I, uh, until I get him out of there. Hi there. Hello. Here we go. Can you make me a key from this serial number? Sure. A shackle key, eh? Special extreme cold hardened version. They don't even make these shackles anymore. I guess you've had them a while? Oh, yeah. They've been in my family for generations. Thanks so much, Jim. Yeah, the serial number trick. Click 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 let's go. Click 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 let's go. Right. Ah, freedom. Now let's get out of here before they come by to refrost the shackles. There's a handy tunnel over there where Chisel Pete escaped a few days ago. I'd like to ask you for a favor in return. It has to do with limes and scurvy. Yes. I'm so glad you could come, Yay. Mr. Stanman. Always happy to help out a fellow entrepreneur in a non-competing industry. We'll start with branding. Lime is the residue in a bathtub. It's thin, it's unappealing. Saying it out loud sounds like whining. We need something with sizzle, with edge, like razor bombs or sour bombs or something. I see what you mean. Guybrush, you were once a young man with adrenaline issues. What do you think? What we call it? Fangberries? Sublimes? I like how that. Huh? Death globes? Saber food. All right, chat, here we go. One, two, three, or four. What, what do we call this thing? Tap that number in. There we go. Do, 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 do. It's one of those things that will be stuck around to, to the end of the game, I'm sure. So it's a big decision. Sublimes. Okay. Sublimes. Let's not get too clever, son. Remember the target market. Oh. Razor bombs it is. Your oh. promo flyer has also got to go. Now let me just show you what I'm thinking. Well, that's we want then. snake oil, crystal vibrations. The more miraculous and improbable it sounds, the better. I'm not sure I'm comfortable with lying. 
Then we won't put it into words. We'll use a picture. Pictures don't lie. They imply. Guybrush, if razor bombs could do anything in the world for you, what would you want it to be? It's a uh, find the secret to Monkey Island. Find the secret of Monkey Island? Guybrush. That's good, but I'm thinking more along the lines of a superpower. Uh, flying, amazing strength. Yes. Irresistible charm? Mm. You've already got that. <laughs> Everybody wants to be charming. That's perfect. Now, lastly, we need a call to action. Get cold, or go dark, or take that. Those don't mean anything. Don't need to. It's just a short, punchy slogan that sounds like you're supposed to do something right now. Hmm. Uh, plunder the main, run the plang, bite these, go more. All right, chat, what should we do? You know, I'll let you vote. I'll let you vote again. I'll let you vote. Even though I don't know if it's going to mean anything like last time. <laughs> what should we do? All right. Bite these. The choice gem. Bite these. Almost too meaningful, but I think we can work with it. Okay. This is your new flyer. Razor bombs. Bite these. Vatelos reduces belly flatter. May also cure scurvy. Come anything else? Wow! Wow! This picture of this guy with a girl. New. Show people this, and they'll be begging for your product. Name your price. Firstborn, anything. Actually, we'll be giving them away. This is a public health initiative. What? Well, now that's just crazy talk. You don't give away the prize bull just because people need bulls, if you follow me. I'm definitely sensing some bull here. <laughs> you follow me. Well, it's about time to close anyway. You can mail me my cut. I'm out of here. Don't follow me. Your cut? Now, wait just a minute. All right, well, cool. Let's take that then. It's a very convincing piece of marketing. I'll just borrow this for a little while. Right, now, to the boats. To the scurvy boats. They're quarantined because they got scurvy. And they won't let me on. Over here. Check this out. I have some exciting scurvy news for you. Read this. Razor bombs, the new amazing miracle fruit. Ah, regrows hair, removes belly fat. Oh, also cures scurvy. Fantastic! Have you got any of these miracle razor bombs? Sure thing, right here. These little green guys. You're sure there's no science in them? Check the flyer. You won't find a whiff of science. We're saved! Bite these and welcome aboard! <laughs> Yay! Look at this yoink the flag. It's seen better days. Yoink. There we go. Well, it's nice to get a warning. I'm sure they won't miss one little flag, but I'd also rather not ask. All right, sweet. I did it. I don't know why I got all those flags, but I, I got them all now. I think I, I, think I got them all, did I not? Um, museum, real flag, quarantine flag. Uh, yup. Is there, isn't there three flags? Am I missing a flag? I have them all again. Sweet. Um, what do I do with these flags? Uh, let's go back to melee item for a second. Are we gonna combine them or something? Oops, no, go back. Okay. Ah, 
Ah. The yes. holes of the three flags line up and show one exact location. I'll mark it with an X. Perfect. I'm so smart. I'm so smart. Look at me. Look at me go, eh? You know what I mean? Right. Uh, this is certainly exciting. Hey, Billy. Hey, Murray. Anything on the horizon? Only your eventual ultimate obliteration. Okay, dive. Well, it looks pretty clear from here. Right, dive, di dive down there. Watch out below. This is really I, deep. I'm really liking it. I've already been diving for four minutes. I've got to turn back now, or I won't be able to hold my breath long enough to return to the surface. Hmm. We're going to need to learn how to burp, aren't we? <laughs> uh, I haven't met anyone who actually does burp, though. Are we lying in wait or just waiting? Nah, we're leaving. Yep. Obviously, that's the last thing. Um, who's burping that I can, like, learn how to burp? Do you need to learn or something? You, oh, maybe I don't need to learn. True. Maybe that's a... Oh, we have something? Do we have something already? Do we have something that could make me- Oh, wait! This stuff here. Gross. Looks like day-old avocado soup. I don't know if that's like something we can use to burp. You know, we'll we, we try it out. Hello. We'll try it out. Hey, how about a burping contest? This is kind of gross, peeps. Always! Winner keeps the blowfish! We keep the blowfish, we could we could go down the water, you know? I can't get my inventory though. I can't access my inventory, so. Aye, well done. Maybe a drink with four. I declare this a draw. I don't. I don't know if this is the answer, but. <sighs> Gross. Looks like day old avocado soup. Hmm. What else do we have that could make us burp? It's old and the bristles are frayed, but it does resemble a toothbrush. True. <gasps> I don't know what else. Can we like combine it with something? I don't know. L let's go back up to where we got it from. We just got this. Well, we've had it for a while, but. What would make us burp? Not done with my drink. Mm -hmm. Oh, hang on. Okay, okay. Hang on. We, we already drunk it. So let's go back here now. Go back in Hello. here. Ooh, that was refreshing. Hey, how about a burping contest? I don't know. <laughs> Always. Winner keeps the blowfish. <gasps> <gasps> oh, I see. Him. <gasps> oh, here we go. <laughs> Yay! I that was an absolute ripper! I hereby declare you the winner! The blowfish is yours! 
Sweet. Let's go. We could have gotten that ages ago. <laughs> we could have gotten that ages ago. That's fine. How you do this? Whatever order you do it in, you know? Okay. I'm not even mortal and I'm feeling the minutes tick away. This is really deep. I've already been diving for four minutes. I've got to turn back now, or I won't be able to hold my breath long enough to return to the surface. Oh, I gotta use the fish on it. It's okay. I long for the day that our roles are reversed, and it's your head stuck on the bow of the ship. How do I use this thing? Blow up the blowfish. Oh, here we go. Yeah, here we go. We can now go down there. Am I just blowing carbon dioxide into this it, though? This is really deep. I've already been diving for four minutes. Think I've got to turn back now, or I won't be able to hold my breath long enough to return to the surface. Now I can use him. My lungs are full of delicious air again. <laughs> it's fine, video game logic. <laughs> you just figured that. <laughs> Don't worry about it. I'm sure it's fine. Oh, this must mm, be the ship. Beautiful. See the key right here. It's shiny. Oh yeah, look at that. They got the um. Oh. Oh boy. Oopsie. I'm not superstitious, but I've seen one too many angry ghosts. I better split. Greetings, fellow chum. I have a story for you. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yes, let's do it. Do I got time to do this? Um, uh. I had just broken through a blockade as thick and deadly as the crab biscuit the scum bar. Yes. And then, all of a sudden, mm -hmm. my ship was swallowed by a titanic alabaster whale with eyes like destiny and skin tattooed by a hundred harpoons. Inside, it was like walking on soft cheese with rivers of pea soup that stank like a landlubber's bait box. One false move, and you'd be wearing Jonah's overcoat, a layer of greasy phlegm as thick as day-old pancake batter. Uh. Then we stuck an umbrella jig head in the beastie's mouth and reeled it in from the inside. Oh, sorry about your ship. <laughs> It's not my fault. They shouldn't have stuck the key in there so hard. Yeah, right, let's get out of here. Oops. <laughs> They're a chum. I had to say seven. Someday, all this will be mine. And it will burn. Right, so we now have three keys. And now five keys total. Uh. Require a uh, witty stolen key and then require old Miss Smith's golden key. Wait, who's the old lady? That's that one. Old old Miss Smith's golden key? Who's, who's that again? I forgot who that was. Who's there? Who's old Miss Smith? I remember the lady, the old lady who got a key stolen. Right, yeah, but who's old? Who's the other person? Hi. Hey, boy. I got three keys. I've got three golden keys. Good for you. But you be careful. Mm hmm. Um. Remind me again what you know about where the golden keys might be. 
Well, the mean little ghost lady got mine. Why? Old Mrs. Smith had one. Uh, I guess she'll have willed it to someone in her estate. There's the one Bella Fisher had. Okay. Must be at the bottom of the ocean now. One somewhere on Bermuda. Look at that one. And one on Terror Island. Where is someone on her estate? So it seems. Oh, maybe. See round, Whitey. Most likely. Let me, uh, yeah, let me go over here. Hi there. Hiya. Um. These are nice. Thanks. Hello again. Would your mother perhaps have been known as Old Mrs. Smith? Whitey Bones said something about an old Obviously. Mrs. Smith. Well, I didn't call her that. But I suppose some Luck people Smith. did. Mainly when she was older. <laughs> um. Did your mother find any of those golden keys she was looking for? One. She left it to me in her well. Okay, okay. I will pay you any amount of money you like for your mother's key. When my mother died, her personal possessions went into probate with the court. When they came out of probate, I was still too devastated to claim them. As you can see from this letter the court sent, they and the key have been destroyed. Well, this is an unexpected wrinkle. Hmm. What happened to your mother's golden key? As you can see from the letter I gave you, the court destroyed the key. Okay. I think I'll browse around a bit. Try not to touch anything. Well, let's see where it's at then. Let's read this letter. Probate Order 1673832, pursuant to Statute E, Section C, Subsection IS. By order of the court, the following unclaimed personal effects have been destroyed. Golden key, fancy box. Looks official. It's got a wax seal of a parrot on it. Okay. Uh, should we go to the court? Or the mayor? On this one. The court, maybe? Do they know something about him? The court of Bermuda? Apparently, but I mean, it can't, it can't be destroyed. The court uh, is the wax seal. True. Well, let's just see what this guy says. This is the only court I know. I submit these official looking documents to the court, seeking a reprieve from destruction. Order! Order in the court! Upon review of said order, the court finds that due to procedural backlog, the listed items have not been destroyed. Oh. Except for the fancy box that Brad from accounting took. The legality of the aforementioned document having been presented is verified. Presenting pleadant may therefore take possession of said items. Oh, I have no idea what you just said, but <laughs> thanks for the key. Order, order in the court. Okay. Outbursts of thanks will not be tolerated. Yay! <laughs> Sweet, that was easy. Uh, a little too easy. Right, now, we got all the keys but the one that was stolen. But I don't even know where they're hanging out at. Um, where are they? Are they on the Terror Island? Seems like a place they would go. Let's go to Terror Island. Meanwhile, here we go. Did I ask you to give the prisoner a drink of water? No, Captain. You did not. I was acting on my own initiative. When I want initiative, I'll ask for it. Of course, sir. I need you to be a team player. And right now, the team is focused on one thing. The secret. Uh, yes, sir. What? What is it? Out with it! Well, it's just that some of the crew have been talking. Tell me already! The feeling is that the secret is not really a team goal. It's been suggested that you think that securing the secret will help you to win over Elaine Marley, which, well, frankly, sounds kind of deluded. It's not realistic, sir. You are not to mention Elaine in my presence! 
and do not presume to know what I am thinking. Sorry, Captain. This will be the last time I bring it up. Yes, it will be. Mm. Trouble. I forget, I forget where they are. Yeah, the voices are really good. Go down the lava chug. Uh, I don't know. Uh, I don't know how close I am. I have like, no idea. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know if I'm halfway through or I don't. I, don't, I think I'm. I think I'm most of the way through. I think I'm over halfway through. I don't know if I'm. I don't know if I'm on um, Terror Island or. Should we like ask them where they're at? I'm kind of close. Okay. Has Iron Rose been back to the ship? She did come back for a bit, yeah. She was in a hurry, went below decks, then came right back up and left again. Oh, very he's interesting. Here. He's here. He's here. He's right here. Hang in there, Bob. Still not funny. These open plan offices are all the rage now. Okay, maybe, maybe in the end. Nice. A slideshow of creepy zombie guys. Ooh, I can't decide which is more disturbing. The hey, truck somehow stealing Elaine's wedding veil? Nice. Or you have a copy made. Sounds like Pinky from Pinky in the Brain. Yeah, it does. I know art is supposed to grab you, but this is taking it too far. Maybe not in here, because I'm not seeing anything. She went below deck and then came right back up. Maybe he went all the way down. <gasps> you know what? And that one likes to throw up. Here we go. Unexpected, but welcome. Grab key. Oh. Yikes. Um, did it from last time? I wonder what it's made out of. You know what? We'll take some. Is a hunch here. Take the demon pepper. Mix it up. No? Okay. I thought I could, uh... I thought that would work. Maybe now I know it's there. Maybe we'll, like, do something with it. Yikes. Hmm. The mop's not here. It did throw up at one time. We must have something. I wonder what it's made out of. We must have something for this. How did we get the throw up last time? That was a long time ago. Can I give it the? Can I give it one of these? No. Can I try this on it? No. The knife? Sure. I think that only works on live chickens. <laughs> hey, clever guy. How are you doing today? Good to see you. You may be overanalyzing. You think? Feed. And what does it say if I scroll over? Taste. Uh, I don't think so. Yikes. Can't grab what's eating. Well, let's just try feeding it again. I already have some chicken feed. And then let it do its thing. Can I overfeed it? It's so rude to watch people eat. Crackers? I don't think you let it. I don't think you do it. 
I think that only works on parrots. That only works on parrots. So. Hmm. Hmm. Excellent. 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 <laughs> the feed didn't work. I mean, I can feed it. You see, it flew up at some point. So I guess that's what we're kind of trying to do again. Yikes. You could bind the pepper with it. That's why I tried. Oh, just try, oh, try it with this. Like, actually, you do this? No. Not a good idea, though. Answer is right here. It's right here. Finger. Do I have to wait until the chicken poops? I mean, let's maybe leave and come back. Oh, you see this? This must be Whitey's stolen key. That's the last key. Okay. Voodoo shop, here I come. Okay. Um. Meanwhile, Creepwood has all the keys. That's right, Captain. Just recovered the last one. Prepare to set sail for Melee Island immediately. How do I know? What about my spell? It's almost ready. I'm sure I'll find some use for it later. I'm afraid I can say the same for you, however. Ah, you're betraying me? I'm the one who does that. But I do respect talent in other people. Game logic. Uh, how do I? I'm gonna leave and come back and we've done it. Okay, well let's do this then. Running. We got all the keys now into the voodoo shop. Mm -hmm. One. Three, four, and five. Oh. Wow. It's cheesier than I imagined, but still beautiful. It's a big old chess. Okay. Hmm. I wasn't really thinking about the possibility of yet another lock. This seems like overkill. Well, there's no serial number. Maybe I can break it open. This is a poem. I choose to see it as a puzzle. This is not a poem. I choose to see it as a puzzle. This is not a poem. I just need heftier tools. The key is probably somewhere. Okay. Um, just keep telling yourself that you're Guybrush. Yeah. This is not a problem. Just keep telling yourself that, Guybrush. Three points! Uh oh. LeChuck, my old nemesis. Here we are again. Looks like this story ends the way it was always destined to end. With just you and me and the secret. Not quite. I don't suppose it'll do me any good to point out that you're cheating again? I've underestimated your resourcefulness, Threepwood. But force always wins in the end. You should try it sometime. Good luck opening that. It's well made. I tried everything I could think of for a whole minute, and I didn't make a dent in it. Of course not. 
The secret can only be revealed in a ceremonial chamber located deep within the bowels of Monkey Island. Oh. That would have been nice to know ahead of time. It pleases me to have you live with the knowledge of how close you were to having this before I took it from you. So, I've decided not to kill you right this minute. That's convenient. Outside that door, the deal is off. Don't even think about following me and count to a hundred before you leave the building. You won't get away with this. A hundred. <laughs> Guybrush! Whiteybone said she saw you come in. Are you all right? No. I mean, yes, I'm fine. Do you want to talk about it? The truck has the secret, and he's headed for the bowels of Monkey Island. The caverns underneath the big monkey head? There's no time to lose. Let's talk on the way. Yay, we did it. Well, we did that chapter. Finally. That did seem like a better way to get here than making the potion. I'll definitely have to take notes next time. Yes, I just hope it turns out to be worth all the effort. Whatever. That was easy. I'm not talking about the trip over. I mean all the work you've done leading up to it. Not to mention the trail of destruction you've left in your wake. <laughs> you mean? Of course, I've heard. Of course. I'm a pirate. It's part of the lifestyle. It can still be surprising when you encounter it in practice. Odina told me an exciting story about what happened on Bermuda. Apparently, you managed to destroy a priceless traditional artifact and the government of an entire island in five minutes flat. That's quite impressive. Even for you. It took way more than five minutes. I had to win a bunch of contests first. Yes, Odina told me your joke. Uncomfortable under the arms. Quite funny. Odina also thinks you cheated on your algebra test and tried to poison her. <laughs> It's the contest of intelligence, not the contest of algebra. I proved my intelligence by cheating successfully. <laughs> you are very clever. Incidentally, I think you might also be royalty now, since you're married to me. I thought something felt different this morning. But I was talking about your freewheeling lifestyle. Did you know the Museum of Pirate Law has shut down? You don't say. Two of its prize exhibits went missing. Curiously, there was only one name in the guest book. Yeah, it wasn't a very good museum anyway. The guy doesn't get his facts right. Conrad Lee is a nice young man who tries hard. But he'll land on his feet. I hear he's going to open a training school for attack parrots. Well, I hope he doesn't hold a grudge. <laughs> Herman Toothrot is also a little upset with you. He says you took his key and left him in a dark cave. Um, the magic uh, sign only works with one person. I can get back to the cave without a lamb. Um. He was already in the dark cave when I found him. So, to be fair, no net impact overall. Except for the key. True, but he wasn't really using it. Well, you'll be happy to know he made it out. I rescued him myself. I am happy to know that. Thanks. Remind me why we're talking about all this? It's just, I'm worried that the secret can't possibly measure up to the effort and anticipation. What exactly are you expecting to find? Which is glory, knowledge, understanding, I have no idea. It doesn't matter. Hmm. What are we trying to find here? Understanding? Knowledge? Glory. What is Guybrush trying to find? I have no idea. I have no idea. That's why it's so important that I find it. Well, be careful what you wish for. Here we go. Just like old times. Are you ready for the caverns? Ooh. I remember them. Full of lava and tiny ledges. It's a good thing you're wearing your adventure boots. Uh oh. Hope you also brought your adventure sword. Well, well. 
Uh, go what on do ahead, you sweetie. think I'll it is? I don't, um, the recipe for some kind of food, maybe? I don't know. I don't know. How how long is this, Catherine? Like, are we like, is this like a fifteen minute one, or is it or or uh, a t shirt? Yeah. Or should we um, come back later? Yeah, but how close? Like an hour? Okay, okay. Because I'm kind of hungry. <laughs> um, you know. It's a couple of voodoo shops. Oh no! Hey, Wally. How's it hanging? Seriously, that's the joke you were going to use right now? Yeah, I'm trying out some new material. <laughs> Don't quit your day job. Wally, what happened? As if you don't know. How did you end up here? I saw your office had been ransacked. LeChuck came into the shop storming mad because he no, thought no. I gave oh, him a mop map instead of a map to the secret. Yeah, real head scratcher how that happened. <laughs> Thanks for the C-map. That was really great, and I owe you for all the work you did for free. Glad you liked it. That mop map you made for me was a winner. Oh yeah, that's right. I did make you a mop map. Wait, it's all starting to make sense now. Why is it that every time our paths cross, good old Wally is kidnapped or tormented or worse? The mysteries of how the universe works may never be known. I wish I could get you out of those shackles. You and me both. Yeah, I'd love to stay and chat, but I've got to get the secret before LeChuck does. Sure. Run off. Wally will be fine. Is that right, Simrock? Sweet. We'll be, we're going to be playing it tomorrow afternoon. Uh, during my afternoon stream on Sunday. Yeah, Wally's fine. Don't worry about it. Um... Out of a key made from the series. Oh, really? Back in chapter two. Okay, we obviously didn't do that. So, sorry, Wally. Sucks to be you didn't. Flambe, uh, you're awake. Three o'clock Eastern. I'm just here to tell you that you are making a mistake. The Chuck's obsession consumes him like a frog swallowing a tarantula. You don't want to be there when he opens that chest. Correct. I want to be there before he opens it. You two deserve each other. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Run! I can't really see down there too well. There's a lot of lava. I can't really see down there too well. Oh, jump down and... Okay. Here goes. Seems kind of dangerous. <laughs> okay. LaChuck, I'm coming for you. I'm coming for you. <gasps> Damn you, Threepwood. I should have gotten rid of you the first 58 times I had the chance. <laughs> you will never make it down here alive. Just once, I want this to be easy. Mm, what does that say? Only the organized pirate will pass. Ah, oh boy. Ah, oh boy. Well. <sighs> it looks proud to be a monkey. You said 20 minutes, Catherine. Um. <laughs> hang on, hang on, hang on. Pr a proud monkey? Um, I'm naming it Captain Squint. Squinty monkey. I can relate. Frustrated monkey. I wonder if the parrot had anything to do with the eye. Monkey with a parrot. You're writing this down, right? Only the organized pirate will pass. Um, 
So. Right. Do I have to use stuff on this? Open chest, find the chug, go for the door. Oh, yeah, yeah. It looks proud to be a monkey. Proud? Is there anything else I can like click on? Oh, hang on. It looks like a piece of eight, but made of stone. Okay, okay. I can relate. Frustrated monkey. Oh, there's another one. It's one of those stone pieces of eight. Okay. There's one in every room. I wonder if the parrot had anything to do with the eye. Maybe this one likes the money? Stone pieces of grit. Yep, it's made of stone. Yep, it's made of stone. Hmm. I combine these together. Hmm. Okay. It looks proud to be a monkey. Right. That it does. That it does. Oh, maybe. Yes. Yes. Okay. Okay. We have something in our inventory. It's bashing something. Knife, maybe? Yep. Looking for something. Yes, maybe? Yep. Okay. And then holding something up. Toothbrush? Pepper? That doesn't make any sense. He's holding something. Proud. I don't know if these wouldn't work on it. No. Mug? Mug. Mug. Yes. Yes. Okay. Cool, 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 cool. Um, the game is great. The game is so good. We're almost at the end of it, so just letting you know. Look, Chuck, the secret will never be yours. Hey, um, I hate solving puzzles more than I hate three points. Can we stop yelling? He's totally solving a Skyrim puzzle right now. It's like a Skyrim puzzle. Threepwood, won't you ever give up and just go home? Once is a coincidence. Twice is suspicious. Yeah, maybe something yelling, Freebird, you know? Only the observant pirate will pass. Okay. Oh, wait. What's going on here? Another coin. Okay. We need a key for this. Those epaulets deserve a room of their own. We have keys. I don't know if any of these keys will go in there. Those epaulets deserve a room of their own. Well, keep looking, I guess. The clever eyes put this one above the rank and file. That's why I assume first swab. Oh, maybe put the coins inside. Go back to this one. They will get a coin. Cheer up, little guy. You'll go far. Hmm. <laughs> um. Well, <laughs> I got big, medium, small. Um.
only the observant pirate will pass. Big chest, medium chest, small chest. Now I put one coin in each. Now I think I put two coins in this one. And I put three coins in the other one. But I don't have enough coins for that, so am I missing a coin somewhere? Oh, uh, oh, I can take coin back. Okay, I can get the coin back if I need to. Um, hey, Goose, fix that raid. Maybe it maybe it's the size of the coin. True, that could be it as well. Get my coins back here. Let's have a look. They all kind of seem like the same size. Yep, it's made of stone. Yep, it's made of stone. Am I missing a coin somewhere? There was one out here. We can go back upstairs too. I don't know if I've missed one out here. That's my first idea. Is that maybe the big one gets more. But I don't have enough coins for that. I'm missing one coin, basically, if that would be true. I don't know. Let's have a look. The difference between them. One's bigger. Maybe the little one doesn't get a coin. Coins are different shapes and sizes, but I don't know if that's uh, necessarily adding them. Um, let's just try this. Did that work? You know, just keep giving out coins until something happens. The clever eyes put this one above the rank and file. That's why I assume first swab. First swab. And then who's this one? Those epaulets deserve a room of their own. As the captain. And then who are you? Cheer up, little guy. You'll go far. Cabin monkey. I'm trying to figure out this puzzle. Oh, yeah, maybe. It seems like it's really a coin thing. Ah, my last coin. That's it. That's it. Do we already have the last coin? One for you. Two for you. Yeah, those are was a DLC bonus. Three for you. Uh, the whole summer is something you got for being, um, you got for pre-ordering the game, and it does nothing. Uh, I'm pretty sure horses don't like lava. LeChuck, the secret is mine! Uh-oh. <laughs> Big brained. You really do suck at puzzles, don't you? How are you still alive? You will never have the secret. I will soon have my revenge. Can you just double cross that then one? You will forever be cursed. And you will never escape. You will vanish with no tails. No, I will return. The secret is mine. Third time be a charm, free weed. 
Whoa. Next time, I keep my voice down. Yes, that was a good idea. Only the bloodthirsty pirate will pass. Okay, let's try this way. It looks like its arm is hurt. Only the bloodthirsty will, uh, power will pass. Hurt arm. It looks like its leg is hurt. Hurt leg. Let's see what I can click on. This is going to be a problem. Straight up broken. There's no way I'm getting through there. Hmm. Right, well. We must have all the things we need. Anything at the, anything at the entrance? Nothing really I can click on. Again, the sign says... Only the bloodthirsty pirate will pass. Let's see if those doorways stay open. Yeah, we're fine, I think. It looks like its arm is hurt. It looks like its arm is hurt. What can we use on this thing? I don't have my knife anymore. Matches. I don't have anything to use on this. Fish. Key. Lime. No. Blowfish. Toothbrush. I don't know what, uh, what we'd use on it. It looks like its leg is hurt. Mm. When did I lose that, Anna? This is going to be a problem. There's no way I'm getting through there. My knife is long gone, is it not? Oh, 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 oh. Let me uh, get one of these. Right, that's fine. It's not long gone. It's right over here. Do you think I get the knife bag? Take knife bag. Hmm, that kind of sucks. <laughs> that's really the solution. So, yeah, put it down in the big LT bag. Okay. Well, let's see then. Stab. Um. Oh, one second, everybody. I feel like if you used it, then you sh like they should have a better solution. I don't know. I don't know. Go get the knife back again. The thing that you used on the earlier puzzle. Okay. Whatever. We've used the knife so much in this game. The knife has been a big solving point. That and the monocle thing. Oops. Can't use the papers on it. That didn't seem to do anything. Right. This is going to be a problem. This one's broken. There's no way I'm getting through there. Do I have anything that I can replace this with? Horse armor. No. Whatever that was the answer. Only if you pre the game could you, uh, could you uh, solve this one. This is going to be a problem. You think... Uh, Well, I can't use it myself. That didn't seem to do anything. 
Stab the lime. I got a pen. Hmm. This is going to be a problem. Well, I can't use stuff on me. At least I don't think I can. No. That didn't seem. Maybe to be use anything. the lime on it, so I can like oh, squeeze out some juice of the lime. No. Okay, we gotta get the juice out of it somehow. The blowfish on it. Oh yeah, yeah. If we can get other stuff back, then maybe we can get the mug. Good point. I mean, I might as well just take all this stuff back. I mean, you know what? I gotta take it all back because I'm probably gonna need it. Maybe. If it's let me do it. My crackers. Good calm. Mm -mm. And then pour that into there. Yay! Hit the coins back as well. Maybe. Alright, well. Let's we'll see what I was going to ask for. That was it. Oh, dang. So long, Captain Madison. This is like one of those mystery stories where the person has so many enemies, the detectives don't know where to start. All right, rotating wheel. Uh, okay. Do we know these people? Change the dates. Close any more possible escape routes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do not touch the wheel. Too late. What do you mean? What do you mean? <laughs> what do you mean don't touch the wheel? Isn't that supposed to be the thing I'm supposed to do? Oh, wait, what's this? One of the stone slabs from the altar seems to have fallen off during the rumbling. There's some writing on it. After four extra years out at sea, their peg legs grew weak in the knees. Three steps right, but two left, till they fell off the deck and they met Davy Jones for some tea. After all I've been through, finding some limericks on a piece of stone sinking into the lava isn't all that strange. So long, Captain Madison. I don't know. I don't know what that means. After four extra years out at sea, four their extra peg legs years. grew weak in the knees. Three steps right, but two left, till they fell off the deck and they met Davy Jones for some tea. Ah, uh, boy. Anything else I can read about here? Hey, Donkey, thank you so much for the 38 months. Appreciate that. Um, I, don't, I don't know. We got one, two. Huh? What? I was just deep in the mushroom and lava-ridden oh. caves under Monkey Island, and now I'm... 
Oh no. Not yet. Uh oh. How? What did I do? What was it? What was it? What was it? What was the puzzle? Play a couple of times so um, I can't type it in. That was so lucky. You have no idea, dog. How did you? I literally have no idea what I just did this then. <laughs> I have no idea. What, what, what was the puzzle? Could you tell me? So I like at least understand what I did. Find the faces and the bottom of the face. Find the face and the bottom of the face, then work out the time and move the time forward. But to be honest, if you had the top and the bottom, I think it could just turn it down. What do you mean top and bottom though? That puzzle took, took 10, that puzzle takes 10 plus minutes. Well, Catherine, you know, um, um, I'm like so big brain that sometimes I'm solving puzzles and I don't even know how I solve them, you know? Like my mind is just doing it for me, you know? Uh, I'm just like, this is how I get from Nancy Drew games. It's like something subconsciously takes over and clearly professional pro gamer. <laughs> this, is, this happens in Nancy Drew too. It was like, all right, we kind of bumbled our way through that one. <laughs> TikTok then, clip it. I don't know if that's gonna be a good TikTok video. Okay, so. We got popcorn on the floor. We got a pretend bird, a pretend rat. Are we back in the theme park? Are we back back in Big Whoop theme park? I'm subconsciously a genius, you know it. This has to go on TikTok. Oof, I don't know how I'm gonna edit that. Go back inside. Open the door. Go Let's go this way. Glad you finally made it, kid. What, Stan? It's closing time and everyone wants to go home. Last chance to hand over the key, locksmith. What do you mean it's closing time? I just got here. No, oh, I don't have time for this. I'm late for an important meeting. Take my keys and shut off all the lights before you leave. I'm not liable for anything that happens after closing time. Guybrush, are you ready to go? Last chance to hand over the key, locksmith. Um. Look at this. Look at this thing. Dang. Stan makes LeChuck better every time. The secret is mine. Each time I come here, Stan really ups the challenge. But it's still LeChuck, zero. Guybrush, Threepwood, six. The secret is mine. Nice twist adding in Madison, Trent, and Lila. The team up had me fooled for a while. The secret is mine. Well, back to my boring flooring inspector job. Until next time. What's happening? Except to Elaine, maybe. Elaine, thank goodness you're here. Of course. Where else would I be? I'm not sure where I am all of a sudden. You're right here with me. But we shouldn't stick around too long. I was just underground on Monkey Island, and now we're on Melee? Things just go by in a blur sometimes when you're having fun, don't they? How'd it go with Flair? Let's just say I made my point.
<laughs> I really got a steal confused. Hey, Sim, how you doing today? Good to see you. Have you played this game? This game is so good. I'm at the end of it, though, so I don't know, you know. Uh, what is the name? Uh, spoilers. But, um, hey, um, me and Sim, uh, I haven't said anything yet. Kind of, uh, we're still getting some uh, details sorted out. But me and Sim are going to do a meetup. And we're teaming up. And we're going to do a meetup together in San Diego. And I like Sim. So, I'm pretty excited. So, if you're in San Diego, I want to see me and or Sim then uh, we'll have details. I think Sim's putting together some stuff for that. Yeah, community meetup. Yeah, 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 yeah. So that's gonna be pretty sweet. Do all the keys work on the chests? Well, right now we don't know what's going on, eh? We don't know what's going on. How did you get here before me? You know I always try to stay a step ahead. Have you done something new with your hair? It got ruffled in the fight. I like it. I'm gonna look around some more. Okay. I that was an absolute ripper. I hereby declare you the winner. Is this is like a, a Westworld situation going on now. The switch is locked. It was nothing. I was just picking some flowers. It was nothing. I was just picking some flowers. Yeah, I should have suspected Stan's involvement the minute I saw how cheap and gaudy this is. Open this bad boy up. Nabbit, it's locked. If only there was a key. Wait a minute, there's a key right there. What a stroke of luck. The locksmith had the key all along. That was disappointingly easy. I wonder what's going on. What is going on? Interesting. I found the secret of Monkey Island, and all it was was this stupid t-shirt. Yeah! <laughs> I mean, oh, that's good to hear, Sam. Just a call was okay. Um, yeah. Kids getting sick are no fun, eh? It's not fun when they get sick. Uh, turn off. The switch is locked. I oh, told me to turn it off, so let's, uh... I go in the, we go in here? Hey, Elaine. Let's renew our vows. Next time, Plunder Bunny. We need to leave. I got the secret. You finally did it. I hope it was worth it. I'm going to have to think about that. I'm ready to go. Good. Mm -hmm. Me too. Seriously. You're terrible at endings. I thought you liked silly endings. You and Chucky play the ending of Monkey Island 2. Really silly. That's different. We're kids, and we're just goofing around. You're the one who said you can't just change things. You said that's not how storytelling works. I did? I want to know the secret. You have to tell me what you really found in the chest. Uh... The chest was really the friends we made along the way. <laughs> Your mom was right. It's better not to know. I wasn't making anything up. That was really what happened. There isn't any one answer what the secret is. Here we this one. The secret was really the friends we made along the way. Stories are mainly the middle part, after all. And that's where most of the good stuff is. That sounds like one of those stupid grown-up answers. Mom! Dad won't tell me what the secret is! 
Are you filling our son's head with your outlandish stories again? I was telling him the one about how we found the secret of Monkey Island. <laughs> oh, that one. <laughs> Every time you tell that story, the ending gets stranger and stranger. Let's go down to the docks and watch the galleon head out. Yay! I found the lost map to the treasure of Maya Island. It's going to be a fun adventure. I'll meet you down there. Are they pirates or what's going, what's going on? Um. Well, there you go. <laughs> okay. Um. So, he mentioned Monkey Island 2, because that's kind of how Monkey Island 2 ended. Uh, it just was him in a theme park. So, then the... You know, it was it was as confusing. Monkey Island 2 was as confusing the ending. Because it was just like, oh, he's in a theme park. So, was this whole thing was imaginary. And it was all in his head while he's at this theme park. Um... And then they made Monkey Island 3, which wasn't Ron Gilbert. And it started with him in a bumper car floating out to sea. So that was like, okay, it kind of like, I don't know, looped it back again. Um, and then so Ron was like, no, we ending it in the theme park. It's all in his head. Monkey Island 3 is so good. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's a fun time. It was a fun time. I'm still not. I'm. I'm. I'm I think the art style is is uh, good. I just. I, I didn't. Didn't absolutely love the art style here. I mean, it was very stylized. My wife brought up a good point. She thought that the the part when he's telling the story should have been like a three D, more of a three D design, and then gone back with like the 2D stuff. Now if you think about, it totally makes sense because all Monkey Islands have uh, theme parks. That's true. It may not have to see Yeah, we'll wait. We'll see what's going on. Wasn't the mom also the pirate lady in the story? At least you get to fight something in, in two left me with a sense of wait what yeah i definitely have that sense uh, wait huh? <laughs> yeah we just finished the game i i enjoyed it i thought i was fun um i hope they make more i just i don't know like the art style i I never was fully sold on it. It's definitely fine, but I never like. I don't. I don't absolutely love this art style. What do you think? We're. I think. I think we're like. We're thinking. Um, what? I think what? Elliot. Oh, Elliot. Go, Elliot. Go back. Go back on the VOD and watch me solve the final puzzle. Watch me solve the final puzzle. You should watch it. Uh, did someone clip it? Did someone clip it? I blew chat away with my amazing big brainness. And then I totally um, guessed and it worked. <laughs> oh, I didn't even guess. I just bubbled through. I clicked it a couple of times and the door opened. And I was like, okay. Doc, you amazing. I know. <laughs> It was really easy, Elliot. Honestly, honestly, I just kind of like scroll the thing a few times. I clicked on the date a few times, and Bing, bam, boom, the thing opened up. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Chat was like, "How?" Um. <laughs> Kevin was a hit burger. <laughs> Do 
Well, I mean, that's the thing, though. I don't look at the, the hints, but I also don't have to because I like to play this with the chats and, you know, the chat. It's like all of us working together to go through it. We don't need the hints. Um, that wasn't anything that, that was difficult. I thought that going back and getting the knife was just annoying as a little puzzle thing. Like having to go get the knife. If I've already used the puzzle, I should have to use it again. That's just an, I felt that was kind of annoying. You like the other side, just not the story. Uh, yeah. Should I wait? How long is this? How long is this? The credits are longer than the game. Do 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 do. Yeah, I mean, these games are never about the story, really. It's about the wacky adventure going through. You can skip what I like. Okay. Something new. Oh, let's see. Hey, want to see my mighty pirate scrapbook? It's ever since I was a kid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. but what about the ending? Uh, these are from the time I went to find the treasure of Big Whoop. One time, this was... Oh, man. Then... Oh, here... These are from the time I found the secret of Monkey Island. Did you, though? The new pirate leaders were focused on sacking and pillaging. But plunder stats aren't everything. I learned more than I ever wanted to know about mops. I made the unusual decision to join LeChuck's crew as a way to get to Monkey Island. I thought they should have used the mop more. That was kind of a fun thing, and then we just kind of, that was it. I thought the mop should have been a reoccurring thing. The knife, the knife was used so many times. And the, and the, uh, the lock picking puzzle was like, that was used like way too many times. I started my voyage at the scum bar, but right away I could tell it wasn't going to be like old times. I think the mop should have been used in like such w in like really wacky situations later on. Serving on the Chuck ship was an interesting experience. I grew to like the crew. I forgot all about looking like a zombie and starting a mutiny and seizing the ship. Gullet was my supervisor. Not a very pleasant guy. Putra was really happy when I got her promoted to chef. My disguise held up great, right up until we were nearing Monkey Island when it, um, well, there was a failure. Even if uh, it remains a secret or the last part at the theme park is fine, but some, uh, but from solving the last puzzle to the part feels really rushed. Yeah. I got thrown off the ship, but that was okay. I'd gotten as far as I needed to. The actual return to Monkey Island was not what I expected. Everybody had a map, some more useful than others. We all thought the secret would be on the island somewhere. Elaine and I rebuilt my old ship, the Sea Monkey, so we could sail back to Melee. The temporary pact I made with my enemies turned out to be about five minutes more temporary than I had hoped. It was a race to get to the secret first. LeChuck teamed up with Madison, but that was never going to last. Madison was scheming to betray LeChuck. Lila was scheming to betray Madison and LeChuck. Wait, they were? When did, when did that come up? When did that come up? I'm not sure Trent ever thought very far ahead. I didn't get that part at all. Missed opportunity, yeah. Uh... Whitey Bones told me all about the Golden Keys. Elaine had a lot on her plate, but she was with me in the end. Carla handled earthquake relief as best she could under the circumstances. He had to learn all the stories in this. Madison dies off stream. Screen. Ah. I broke Stan out of prison. Wally was kidnapped. The voodoo lady disappeared. I unseated the reigning queen to become the last queen of Bermuda. I visited Herman Toothrot in his cozy hermit cave. I hunted down all five golden keys. We chased the Chuck back to Monkey Island again, and I tracked him down. 
don't know how I solved this. I made this mock-up of the final puzzle. I think it's pretty neat. Still don't know how I solved it. Elaine held off Flare Gory while I went into the monkey. Someone had devised a series of themed pirate monkey puzzles to keep out the unworthy. I found Wally. Wait, what's this? Mm. Development won't start for another month or so, but we've been thinking about this for a while. It seems like a good time to jot down a few thoughts and then dash them away, sash them away as a sort of time capsule message for our future selves about what we're, what we're setting out to do with the Return of Monkey Island. Who knows, we might learn something. Monkey Island has historically been a reflection of the lives of the people who made the games. The sequel of Monkey Island was about a young person setting out to pursue an excellent new career. As, a, as designers in our 20s, that's what we were doing as well. The sequel of Chuck's Revenge, in many ways, was about the difficulties of making a sequel, or at least about what one does immediately after something that felt like a great success, but which went unnoticed by most in the world at large. Many years, 20 later, after Guybrush had gone on a couple of adventures with other teams who had their own hopes and challenges, we set out to make the tale of Monkey Island as a story about uh, trust, and it is, but what jumps out the most of us that felt like a story about grown-ups. Because that's what we were, many of us in uh, 40s by then, with children and lives. Do you need, uh, do you need, do you need the voice acting, Gluana? Um, how long is this? Okay. We are well our 50s now. Wait, hang on. Did they say they worked on the, the... Oh, that's right. Juan did go and work on Tail. They brought him in to work on Tails of Monkey Island. I think I remember that now. I think so. It must be because he's saying it here. He didn't mention three and four, really, because other teams work on that. And then they made... We set up to make Tales of Monkey Island. That's the Telltale version, which is I think is really good. Um, maybe we'll play those on stream. I don't know. Um, anyway. Uh, we're now in the 50s. We had legendary uh, careers. We've made a lot of games, but Monkey Island still defines us as a certain degree, or at least in our minds of many, we are those guys who made that game a long time ago. And it felt like there's some unfinished business there. There was an opportunity arose to come back to Monkey Island. We were pretty much on the same page as to what we wanted to do. Guybrush, like us, is older now. And he had a long and reasonable successful career. But he is mostly associated with something that happened a long time ago. And it felt unfinished to him. The game is a goofy pirate adventure, the same as it always was, but also it's a story about trying to recapture the past with all its uh, alleged youthful strength and glory. Guybrush will both succeed and fail at this. He will sort of get what he wants, but it won't be what he expected. Okay, whatever. <laughs> That's it. That's it. It's a really a story about us. Okay. Get more paper for the rest of my adventures. Oh, yeah, okay. Okay. I don't know. I don't. I don't know. I don't know if I agree with that. I mean, I guess they're trying to make it deep. I don't know why they felt the need to make it deep. That that was one of the things I didn't like about this game. Like they gave Guybrush his five o'clock five o'clock shadow. I'm like, I don't know. Guybrush is like this young, bumbling doofus. 
who somehow gets what he wants um, via the most ridiculous means possible. Go back into the game. Wait, like, load game? There's another thing. Like, load game? Or what do you mean go back in the game? How do I go back in? It's a long way to explain why they copped out the ending. How how am I going back in? By just loading up the last save? Or this one here? Okay, which is this one here. I, I guess. Or is it this one? Hang on. 924, 925. Okay, it's this one here. I feel like I'm back here, though. Read the plaque. Historic landmark. The original secret, a pirate adventure park. Established 1989 by R. Gilbert. Is that what was added? Ron Gilbert. Historic landmark. The original secret, Go a back adventure through the park. doors. Established 1989 by R. Gilbert. Oh, like over here? It seems to be stuck closed. Uh, must have locked when I came out. Open the door. Open the door. Which one? Which door? Oh, the key. Oh, oh, okay. Oops. Ooh. So long, Captain Madison. What am I doing? I don't want to close any more possible escape routes. Go and go. Well, how? What, what were you doing, Catherine? That you're like, I'm just going to go back through this game. I'm not satisfied. I'm going back into the game. Just, just work my way up. Just work my way back up. Go all the way out of here. I didn't read what? Oh, what is it? The credits? I'm just so confused. <laughs> um, thank you so much. Um, appreciate that, Unin. Wait, what does it say? It says in the end there. I just I looked at chat, so. <laughs> More credits. Whoopee! <laughs> There was an option to allow reality and stay in the game. Oh, okay. All the way out? Should we try that again then? This game is so weird. Deny what I thought I saw downstairs and return to the world I know. Oh, okay. And that's what the could have puts up. Got it. Okay, okay. <laughs> if you like, I don't want, I don't want any of this weird world. I'm going back to the Monkey Island world. Either way, the thing uh, was. I've never seen credit sequence from a from a UK or US made a uh, film game uh, that doesn't have a Dave or David in the ending. <laughs> That's it. That's the end of the game, peeps. We did it. We did it. Finish the game. That's cool. I like I like the I like the I like the game. I liked it. I enjoyed my time with it. Whoever said they felt like they watched the ending, I totally agree. 
He's like, all right, we got to finish this. Let's just, uh, uh, or maybe they didn't. Maybe that's what they always planned. Maybe they didn't because they, they're like, all right, you never really get the secret. And, uh, I was having a great time, uh, till the end. <laughs> you know what? I feel like that's kind of like the problem with it, You know, that's the problem with everything though. No one can do a good ending. Nobody. Game of Thrones couldn't do a good ending. Lost couldn't do a good ending. Like, no one can really do a good ending anymore. It's like... It's either gonna be... It's either they're trying to, like, be too deep or something, or they just get bored and want to end. Yeah. <laughs> Existential crisis game. <laughs> I can't remember how uh, Tales of Monkey Island end. I don't think it was as annoying, so... Maybe we should play that. It's like five episodes. This is why I never finish games! Never disappointed if I never get to the ending. <laughs> I mean, anyone haunt me in the village for a while? Maybe not. I feel like... Uh, they enjoy a good troll, yeah, maybe. I'm sad that it annoyed you. Nah, dude, I'm, I'm overall, I enjoyed the game. I, I, I like Monkey Island. When they bring out another one, Catherine, I'm going to buy it and I'm going to play it. I think that letter at the end, though, really made it sound like they were going so deep. Like, Guybrush is like, come on, we started out and then... The second one was like us trying to make a sequel. What? What do you mean it was like us trying to make a sequel? You made a sequel. And then, then there was like another one. And then this one was all about like, we're in our 50s now. And I don't know. It was like the pressures of that life, you know? But you want to be like we were before, but you know? And then you take the rubber chicken and you put it on the pulley and then you go over the wire, you know? <laughs> it doesn't have to be deep. It doesn't have to be deep. <laughs> it's about doing things. <laughs> uh, here's the thing. Ron Gilbert had um, his theme park ending in two. Then three and four came out and people loved three. He didn't. So he went back to the ending he wanted the game to be. That's actually, that is actually, um, that's quite true. That's, I agree with Saffron on that. He ended two the way he wanted in waking up at a theme park. The game was successful enough that they made a third one without him and brought it back in. And he's like, no, it has to end with him in the theme park. So maybe there won't be another episode, another game. Anyway, we did it, so. And there won't be another one. But though, if this sells well, are we going to get another one in every single episode of him waking up in a theme park? <laughs> I agree, because the art style of that game... Hang on, let me see. Is it on Steam? Oh, yeah, it's one game. Uh, Curse of Monkey Island. Yes, it is on Steam. Hang on, let me show you. Hang on, let me just... Yeah, yeah, this is the third game. Like it was all animated like this. It looks so good, like it was a cartoon. I mean, obviously not exactly. It was. It was. When did this game come out? In the nineties. This is just. This is just the opening cutscene, apparently. Play uh, Grim Fandango. Like, I love the art style. Is this just the opening? Yeah, yeah, yeah. See? Now, again, the ending of the second one, he's in the theme park, right? And so, I guess, to uh, get him back in, he's it starts out and he's on a bumper car floating in the middle. They don't ever explain. Guybrush Threepwood. Lost at sea for days now. I have no crew or navigational instruments. No provisions except a half-eaten corn dog. And unless I find water soon... I'm surely done for. Only the hope of my really love, Elaine, keeps me going. Well, my quest for the fabulous treasure called Big Whoop has left me in this sorry state. I thought it would bring me fame and glory. Instead, it delivered me into the clutches of my enemy, 
The zombie pirate LeChuck. Is it? I thwarted his evil plot to marry Elaine and he was after Agreed. Revenge. The outside's so much better. Uh, really, really thirsty now. If only I could have a small drink of fresh water, I might have the strength to sail on. Oh, but I know there's nothing but ocean for miles and miles. If I could reach Dragon the Quest, find water and some food. Fruit, maybe. Something to fight off the scurvy and help me get my strength back. Mm, maybe some bananas. Oh, why do I torture myself like this? This is just the opening of the game. I wish for some chicken and a big mug of grog for all the good it'll do me. Oh, my sweet Elaine. Am I cursed to starve here on this ocean without seeing your face just one more time? Am I... Yeah, the tentacles, that's good. I don't, the only issue is I don't know how it holds up. Does anyone know? How does it hold up? Like, are the jokes, like, appropriate in this day and age? Um, yeah, that's the, uh, that's the, well, that's what that one looked like. So, um, anyway, um, that was good. We did it. I, uh, yeah, no, I, I, I enjoyed the game. Don't get me wrong. I liked it. Just, uh. Oh, what's this? Take it. You know, this I skipped uh, to the very end. Yeah, this is the ending. Oh! There are actually kids in this one, too. Thank you for hunting down your brother like me. Ah, you know what? Mask off. That's the beginning of the game. Okay. Ah, so there you are. Who are you people? Just the same old family you've always had. Oh, I didn't know that. It's been a long time since I played this game. You boys didn't get it. So they literally, they, when we said they, they kind of like a Nord free four and tails, they did kind of. Good. I wish you wouldn't. Because the game kind of starts out the. Yeah, this is the end of Monkey Island 2. And then they just walk off. Uh, this is weird. What's going on here? Well, come on then. Let's go ride the madly rotating buccaneer. Yeah. There's the weenie. That's how Monkey Island 2 ended, and people were like, what? Really? People are upset about the setting, too. Um, people are upset about the setting as well. So, um, it's like that all over again. Um, that's like the second game you've completed since I've uh, become a gloovy. See, Mickey? They always make fun of me, Mickey, but when you really calculate it, I've actually finished a lot of games. You know? It's all just a myth. They like to say I never finish games, but really, we finished quite a bit of games. I just often play games that don't have anything. Telltale made one, yes. Wait. I've seen Dot finish about six or seven games. <laughs> yeah! It's pretty sweet. Um, anyway, anyway, we'll call it here. That's why I never finish games. It's always been sweet. That's how, you know what? We felt the same way after Stray, didn't we? We're like, oh, okay. <laughs> oh. Yeah, we'll wait somewhere. Don't worry about it. Uh, sweet dinner's ready. Have a good dinner. Um, what would you play next? I'm not today, but like, maybe I, maybe I, maybe I'll get the tail. Maybe I get the tails of Monkey Island, or Day of the Tentacle, or King's Quest. You know the games are uh, King Quest games are really good. 
um, I don't know. At least Stray had an ending. Boom! <laughs> what if Stray woke up and it was just a cat in a theme park? That would have been a great ending. Yeah, I, I, I had a fun time too. Uh, I keep replaying it till I get all the achievements, yeah. I will buy you the remake of... I have it already, Ape. I have it. Do we go through that game? Stray is awesome. Yeah, I am. Hey, all right. Do, 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 do. Um, let's see. All right, we're going to go out of here now. Um, um, is that... Uh, yeah, uh, Grim Fandango? Yes, it's, um, it's an adventure game. I've never played it before. But it is, uh, it is an adventure game made by... It's... Uh, is it pretty good or is it amazing? It's a point and click adventure, yeah. All right, chat. Thanks so much for being here. Uh, we'll be back uh, early tomorrow afternoon for another stream. Oh, we're going to play some Dreamlight Valley. It's going to be great. Are you all awesome? Thanks for being here. See you next time. Bye-bye. Mm,